Fallen, the Fire Emblem Fallen Kingdom, where I fell down the stairs. <laughs> May I introduce myself? Yeah, go for it. Yes. Okay. Welcome, everybody, to Fire Emblem Fallen Kingdom, home of the Fire Emblem Fallen Kingdom. May I take your order? Hey, can I yeah, get my I'll take a... <laughs> uh, can I get a... Uh... Last I time... Food at home. Last time I did the recap, and this time I'm also going to do the recap because it's the same map. Yay! So, y'all have bring heard... up chaos again. For this chaos! Oh, yeah. oh, no, we actually have a different map theme this time around. <laughs> oh, we're going to have a different map theme? Okay. We are, yes. Uh, last time around, we had heard a scream in the middle of the night. So, um, Zeradon decided, fuck it. I'm just going to go charge the monastery and call it good. And yeah. everyone who was with Zeradon was like, you know what? We're also going to investigate the monastery because one, shit, he just Leroy Jenkins his way in there. And two, mm -hmm. we're kind of concerned. Mm -hmm. So we stormed the monastery. Uh, upon entering, there was a monk who was guarding the path saying that nothing was wrong. Everything is perfectly normal, as it always is, all the time. As you do. Taro specifically mentioned that uh, those screams happen every night at midnight around here. That's not normal. She knows this. Yeah. She's not from around here. Yeah. Um, and then when you got in here, things were a little uh, odd. Spooky. You found two barrels in this room. And you found a chest with a skeleton in it in that room. The skeleton came to life as soon as you tried to investigate the chest. And the two barrels broke apart, turned into this weird wine-red slime substance type thing, coagulated into one gigantic monstrosity, and then fought. So it's been a weird weekend for you guys. Also, Absolutely. I wasn't in Spain. Oh, where were you? <laughs> Florida. Oh, yeah, Portugal. Got it. Sorry. I mistook. Portugal. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm going to eat your kneecaps, Kubi. You're not going to get very much meat up of those, but okay. But you're, I'm going <laughs> to. You're going to find it? You're just going to find meat? going to find meat, staple it to my leg, call it good. Yep. Yep. And then eat it. Just um, to prove a point. Well, wow. anyway, so they opened the chest, which contained a magic key, which opened this gate. Mm -hmm. And we went downstairs and found a, a, a room with faded copper walls. Oh. And oh. several barrels. I don't trust the barrels. Yeah. We weren't even here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah but I don't trust the barrels. What do, you, do we want me to come in like this and just be like, <laughs> okay, guys? Uh, roll for damage. Oh, shit, really? <laughs> just kidding, man. They crit by the stairs. <laughs> Critical shit. <laughs> yeah. Please. So, this is a joke now to, to the people watching. In between sessions, I have broken my leg. <laughs> so, that that's a funny joke. Ow. Uh, actually, for right now, Vulcan, you can go ahead and keep playing Chaos. That's why I wanted to... <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, I, I wanted to do my recap first before... Uh, I, I hate the empty background. So, uh, stop. Stop. Sorry, man. Stupid thing. Stupid YouTube. I... Yeah, there. I, I had thought... That's rough, buddy. Oops, didn't mean to ping. Don't, don't ignore that. Don't ignore it. Don't ignore it. All right. No, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Damn, that, that's a pile of gray and brown. Fuck, I can't remember colors. Ringo is doped up on pain. I'm a little, one pain pill, so. Mm. Do not so click later. until you are, okay. That, that's, that's a surprise tool that'll help us later. Okay. okay. Where's this? Don't worry about it. I'll tell you okay. later. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's your head. Secrets. 
Why are secret, we secret secret color filter? Red, orange, green, blue. There we go. Sorry, <laughs> I had to. I had to be um. Color coding. I had to be specific about colors, or else my brain would explode. <laughs> oh no, you're good. So, you find these barrels okay. and a locked door. Are we going by initiative right now, or? Uh, we can. Want to roll for initiative? Sure. Sure. Right. Let's roll for initiative, everybody. I need to the dice chip. Why is my phone still burning up? I'm doing that for my own sake. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, Good okay. Idea. Oh, fuck. Oh, Nessa. I mean, it's good that I'm going last anyway. True. Still. You I just do it for fun. <laughs> oh my god. So I think Vulcan's going first. Critical yeah. Yeah. I really <laughs> wanted this to. Wow. Nessa, <laughs> are you about to blow up the barrels? No questions, Six please. <laughs> no questions. <laughs> okay, so, uh, so let me go ahead and sort you all into turn order here. Beep. I'm already um, at the bottom. I'm good. <laughs> I believe that's right, right? Correct. It's just the rainbow backwards and then me. Which is still technically the rainbow backwards, because red and purple are technically next to each other on the rainbow, if you want to be wrong about it. Correct. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's like a it's like a wonky rainbow. Mm -hmm. Typically not because it's on completely drugs. opposite wavelengths of you know the color spectrum, but you know. I mean, color spectrum is a spectrum, so just look at the wonky spectrum. Yeah. All right. Anyway, yeah, anyway. Well, you're up. <laughs> so, uh, upon seeing the room just in the first place. <laughs> Phoenix is, yeah, Phoenix is absolutely just going to have a very determined look on her face. And she'll pull out uh, specifically her lightning tome. Oh. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, stand back, everybody. Uh, uh, can I uh, take something or... You no, may. Oh, What's up? Uh, can I just... Ask her to hold for just a second. Hmm. Maybe. So, <laughs> real quick, can I take off my gauntlet and see if I can feel the if there's any air currents in the room? Ooh, that's clever. Yes, you may. Roll for pe roll for uh, roll for perception. I can talk. I promise. Perception is oh, off and twelve. That tracks. Thirty-seven. So, what can I tell about the air, though? Uh, room feels kind of um. Oh, what's the word? Is it stagnant? Like the air has been kind of like uh. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Stale. stale. The word. Oh, yeah, the air kind of feels stale down here. That is exactly what I'm looking for. Well, I have an idea. How much do we want to bet that there's anything valuable down here that can survive a fireball? <laughs> You're suggesting nuke this night from orbit? I'm <laughs> suggesting that we fall back, put in something flammable in here, torch it, and then just basically burn out the oxygen. Because if it's stagnant air, then that means it's not ventilated. So it's probably not going to get fresh air from anywhere. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. If we stack I will keep in mind together. if we do this, all these barrels, if they're like the ones up there, they contain threats. I don't know what these are. So yeah, that, that's why I'm just, suggesting basically, you know, we start a fire, we shut the door, and we hold it until uh, yeah, well, the thumping stops. <laughs> Do God. do do remember that the reason we came down here is there was a scream. True. So there there might be somebody yeah. else down here who oh, doesn't true. need to be. <laughs> can I? Uh, can I see? One at a time. Uh, let's start with Zach. What's your question? 
Okay, so can I see the entirety of this room where... Yeah. Like, I, I'm i assuming that this is actually... Oh, I'm doing the wrong thing. I'm assuming that this here, is that wall or is that another opening? That's a wall. That is a wall? Okay. Mm -hmm. And then that is a shut door. Mm -hmm. So if we do the... If we evacuate the oxygen, it would just clear this particular room where we have the six barrels. Uh, theoretically, yeah. Theoretically. I'm just worried someone might be in the barrels. Well, I will... Yes. This <laughs> is... Yeah, that, I'm not that, worried that, would that there be, are. Yeah, that would be... That's <laughs> kind of why I was going to attack the barrels. <laughs> why don't we go yeah. attacking? Firebomb later. Attack now. Well, I mean, that's basically the same that's plan, though, isn't it? basically the same yeah, plan. It's basically the same plan, just, like, I was going thunder be with the thought that, oh, it, yeah, even if it's just, like, partly liquid or whatever, like, it's a gelatin of any kind... It'd, it'd still be more susceptible to thunder, helpful. I would think, at least how I would, I would think, feature it. Yeah, no, I, that's how I would go. Thunder would be my go-to. I mean, I guess... Like, if it's filled with sludge, yeah, I'm going to do, electrocute it. <laughs> we can draw out everyone into this room instead of... Potentially, so, yeah. Do you mind if I look at the, like, door, see if there's anything on it? Before we nuke oh, it and sure possibly anything. blow up whatever. Oh, I, I almost God. don't want to. I almost don't want to mess with things so we can have the element of surprise. True. In case, because we were, we messed with a lever over there and it opened it, it, it triggered things in a completely different room. So. True. The bunker clearing tactics would work. I do. I do appreciate the thought. That that is really cool. <laughs> yeah. Um, the. I am I am down for trying to get rid of a bunch of enemies at once. Yep, hmm. we'll do it either way. Y'all want? <laughs> all, vote. all in favor of? Uh... Wow, my brain just stopped. All in favor of bunker clearing tactics. Uh, all in favor I, of individual I, nuking. I. I I the thought of individual <laughs> nuking means less likely that we're going to congeal them all together. I that didn't work before when I messed with one and both of them broke open and merged. But. Yeah, we didn't we didn't really like provoke either. Well, at least my I perspective. One. Yeah, my perspective. I wouldn't consider what we did trying to provoke them. Because okay, my but... fears is we provoke one of them and they're all going to break open and merge. All or right, something. then we go bunker clearing tactics. Then you're right. So we can get the surprise. Yeah, right. we'd, we'd get the surprise at least on this room. True, but yeah, I'd rather take on the blast. This, this room four is other buildings is ten. This is over half of the barrels. Well, we don't know what's in the other ones, but mm, it's a well... decent number of barrels. We dealt with two and it was a lot. Six, I'd rather have an advantage. Then I guess we back into the hall. Do we have any <laughs> flammable material? Got a lot of wood in here. Uh, <laughs> the barrels are made of wood. Looks, <laughs> Ringo kind of looks down and looks back up. Oh, uh, I could burn a scarf. Do you want to burn a scarf? I have a fish. The I fish was, is not I going to do anything. <laughs> I know. I'm just being an idiot. <laughs> um, Ringo's <laughs> Ringo kind of takes off her poncho scarf and kind of hands it as Man, a, like, a flammable thing. That's not... No, okay. you're thinking on a completely different okay. scale. Um, okay. When we came into town, did we pass by a tavern? Uh, yes, you did. There was a inn slash tavern in the top left over here. How much gold do we have? And how much are <laughs> kegs of whiskey? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Can we... Um, it depends on how much individual gold you guys each have. Uh, let me check. Uh, out. Yeah, that's funny. I have the money. Yeah, because yeah. the tournament Ringo has the money. There you go. That's that's where Ringo could have been last session. Buying yeah, a bunch of beer for a party that we never showed up to. You want me to just, like roll in with a bunch of keg, like a keg? All right, guys, <laughs> time to celebrate. What's going on? <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I'm, I'm not going to give that one to you. That's a bit too lenient. You would have had no idea. Yeah. But for the oh, moment, just... they're mm -hmm. not Lincoln. aggressing us, so we can Correct. send, you know, one of these mounted people that we have on our party to <laughs> run and find something with the, the highest proof <laughs> possible <laughs> and get Are a or two of it. Are we allowed I have no goal. to do this? I am going to let you guys do this because, holy smoke, that's really fucking funny. All right, here's, <laughs> here's a... Okay, how much do you think a keg would cost, Kubi? I'm doing some math. <laughs> <laughs> and again, we're we're looking for highest proof, so like we're, we're looking for spirits, not necessarily just your random ass, you know, bread, water, beer. Right. We need... Yeah. Oh boy. Vodka or lantern oil. Probably. Lantern oil we could also do, but I don't I I mean if there's a shop that sells lantern oil, that would obviously be better. Probably cheaper. Bombs. <laughs> would be probably Alton. cheaper, yeah, if you got lantern oil. <laughs> okay, lantern. so in my individual notes, a cup of ale is is two gold for a single cup. Um, and that's I'm assuming just the, the most proofed um cheap substance we have so if we're going one liter equals four cups a, a keg would be about 50 liters which would be about 211 um i'll give you math here i'll give you about 800 do you think that would be enough uh, oh <laughs> so that'd be 422 gold for a single keg if i'm doing my math right okay well what about the uh, the lantern oil idea? That might be a little bit better than the shops are closed. Room. Yeah, oh, that is, is it true. Is the shops midnight. are closed. <laughs> the shops okay. do close at midnight. All right, so the yeah. shops so... are closed, but are they guarded? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, my <laughs> oh my god! god. <laughs> hey, I, I I'm saying we you take know? the the we we take the keg of lamp oil. We leave the gold and the note. <laughs> Saying that it was Why good for the betterment this? of the village. Hell, we might I even like... have a tip. Hey, hey, oh my hey. god. I'm just imagining going in, it's like, hey, we 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 paid for this, we needed to nuke a temple. And, uh, you know, yeah, that's gonna go over well. And you know, you know a temple of worship? Phoenix uh, is absolutely on board with that because she you has know what? you got Ringo on board, even though Ringo really hates the stealing idea. Just We're just not stealing. We're just buying outside of okay. standard business hours. Well, yeah. Well, Locke, if you want to do us a huge favor. If you could see the look on his face right now. <laughs> it is like this weird mix of like bewilderment, excitement, and just... I'll leave you okay, the... Okay, let's see where this goes. Locke, if you would steal a giant keg, keg worth of oil... I will give you the gold to do so. Just leave it there for them. <laughs> That's a very Can important thing to tack onto that. Yeah. Uh, leave a note said we had to buy this uh, after hours. Uh, do not say who we are. That's a bad idea. Just leave the money it's worth. Anonymous, we had to buy this. It's an emergency. <laughs> yeah. Uh, There's not gonna be I any will, connection to a temple going up in flame. I will. Give you 800 gold <laughs> uh, after hours. The uh, the temple is stone. It's not gonna go up in flame. It's fair. Yeah, it's the, gonna be oh, rapidly and, evacuated of oxygen, but that'll be fixed as soon as we get the door. Also, with the description of these walls, like it, the <laughs> it, it looks yeah it looks and sounds like it's more like uh there like metal is. walls. <laughs> Mm -hmm. The walls and are made also, of copper, but the building itself is made of granite. Cool, it's cool, also... Okay. Hang on. Yeah. Uh, Zach first, then we'll go to you, Ringo. Oh, I was just going to say that it's a monastery to a Lovecraftian elder, you know, god. So at this point, who gives us gave a sphincter if it survives or not? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> well, for all, all the towns... For all the townsfolk know, it's a it's a it's a temple worshiping a harvest god. Mm -hmm. We can hold a press uh, conference in the morning. So, yeah. how much is a keg worth of of uh, oil, lantern barrel, oil? Like a barrel. A barrel worth of lantern oil. 
So a liter of lamp oil, as I'm going for it, is a gold, a single piece of gold. So mm -hmm. if we're going for a keg equals 50 liters, that's 50 gold. All right, I'll give them. A, I'll here. give lock. Leave a lock with a hundred gold. So give them about. <laughs> just we're paying extra because it's ra rational order. Okay. Uh, uh, so huh. I would. Mm -hmm, I need hey. you to steal a keg worth of lantern oil for me, please. Is anybody else going to be joining Locke on this lamp oil heist? I'll go, I'll, I'll go with him. Are you sure? Uh, let me see. Never mind, I will yeah. not. I have a 13 in stealth. Yeah, I have a 16. Mm -hmm. Hold on, let me you check my You make sense, because you have a horse. Yeah. Zeradon's uh, stealth makes sense, because he's in massive metal armor. Ka-chunk, ka-chunk, ka-chunk. ka, -chunk, ka, -chunk. ka -chunk. Um, I'm... I'm I'm more intimidating than I am uh, stealthy. I feel like that's a lot of us. My yeah. stealth is twenty five, but I can't fight back as well. So do with but that. But you can't will. make him go again. <laughs> I that could. That is true. You need Somehow to get I in and get out real fast. Has what? Thirty. Oh, okay, thirty. So, I said fifty. I'm like Jesus. So, I, so you have a horse eyes. Did you see Ringo do the cute, like the soft, like puppy, puppy eyes? And this, just, are you willing to steal lantern oil so we can blow this fucker up? You're not stealing it. We're, We're giving it. them the money, funny or it. <laughs> Please. Just, just eyes. <laughs> oh my god. You want me to roll for for uh, charm? Mm-hmm. All right. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, with disadvantage. If you if you okay. if you roll better than he does, I'll I'll give okay. it to you. Okay, one D one hundred. Mm-hmm. Okay. I rolled a thirty-two. 32. That's within my charm uh execution. I rolled an eight. Oh fuck. Oh so... <laughs> you just you just see her get like immediately bobbed. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> <laughs> just like okay he appreciates where you're coming from he does not want to get directly involved so here's kind of yeah. how the conversation goes look your heart's in the right place I know what you're trying to do you want to save whomever is trapped inside this temple we, we all heard that yell I have a very specific position to uphold here if people got wind that I was the one going around blowing up random temples to gods and getting involved in grand theft lamp oil. That's not yeah. going to go over well for our entire campaign. Valid. Oh, well, I can do it. However, he leaves. Huh? What? He's what is leaving he and he's going to be sitting in the tavern. Basically, what he tells you before he does this is, if you're going to do it, I'm not going to be a participant. Because I want to make sure that this action does not reflect badly on the Alberic army. Individual actions do not reflect as a whole. Okay. True. That's fair. All right. Yeah. I'll, I'll So I'm going this. to pretend I heard none of this. Mm-hmm. Damn. And Alrighty. So... Lock... Uh -huh. If you take Nessa, yeah, well. you guys could go get the lamp oil pretty quickly. Oh boy. Okay. Sure. <laughs> you have a better chance than me. Look at me. I, I, I wear a giant fucking red coat. <laughs> Where bites are you? Oh, there you are. Thank you. Where did you come from? I, I did give him a. Uh, Oh, a I fucking to yeah. These guys home. There, we, there we go. Now they're home. Yay! Uh, uh, what about this guy? Uh. Oh, shoot, oh, shoot, oh, shoot. Just, I'm assuming he has a home. It's just not on the map. Yeah. This guy would be there. Uh, let me think. Let me think. Let me think. Actually, yeah. This is this is about correct. The guard would still be doing his rounds at night. And then these three, monks, these three monks would be guarding the entrance here. So this is all still correct. 
Mm-hmm. You got this. Okay. Uh, line of sight. Let me think here. He would be able to see... Boop. Boop. At his current position. That's kind of his line of sight. It's blocked oh, here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Stealth operation. I need to go find us some stealthy music. Pink <laughs> <laughs> Panther theme. <laughs> 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 oh, I want metal gear. <laughs> I like the yeah. idea of Ringo, Ringo, Ringo probably sat there and went, I probably should have gone with them. That was a bad I, idea to just send them alone, huh? Maybe not. You'll never know. Why did I make my other bard characteristics still? <laughs> I think it's funny. I mean, hey, the art of music is knowing when to shut up as well, so it works. True. That was my thought process. Oh, boy. Uh, there is a very specific song that I want to play. <laughs> I found it. <laughs> I found it. I need chaos. You don't like my music choice? I do, I do like <laughs> your music choice. However. Not Fire Emblem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold up. <laughs> I'm sorry, what is this called? Um, oh, I'm getting too much. Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> I'm sorry, but my father was talking to me. What, we're we're going to music. Ooh, and yes! Which one? Oh, I'm excited. This is so good. <laughs> this is so good. <laughs> it's the perfect intervention for the Lovecraft War. <laughs> it's both the uh, stealth and just chilling in the temple music. I love that. A wog, wog, wog. Like Patui. Ah, one got in my mouth. Patui. <laughs> it's the it best. Wait, wait. Wait. Isn't this for Donald? Uh, I think it's for silly supports. Pretty much. Yep. It was originally played because Alyssa, uh, Frederick, Crom, and the main character were walking through a forest, and and Alyssa just says, "Ah, a bug right. got in my mouth." <laughs> Right. I think this is played if you romance Crom as well. <laughs> oh, during yeah. the bathhouse scene. Yep, you're right. Oh I believe you God. are. <laughs> All right. Good luck with your stealth. Thank you for your okay. cooperation. So we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and start an initiative order. Uh, Nessa and Locke will go back and forth. Unless you four over here have any other ideas you want to attempt whilst we're waiting. <laughs> I'm just standing guard in case, you know, something comes crawling out of there. <laughs> That's fair. I guess I could talk to Taro and hit show her the letter <laughs> that I found. Oh, okay, we'll get to that in a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna go check in the sky. <laughs> oh, God. Um, well, all right. Um, what is what is your what is your move? We're going to actually be doing like a, a legitimate stealth op here. Uh, well, I'm gonna let Locke go first, and then okay. I can perform and have him go again. <laughs> That's incredible. Oh, wait, okay. can I stealth? Can I play a flute stealthily? Yes. Great question. We're gonna find out. That's a really good question. question. <laughs> when were the flutes invented? So you Pardon? have a maximum movement of six, right? So you're you can go here up till there. I have I have a move of seven. Do you? I'm thief movement. That's right. Because you took the <laughs> Even took better. daggers. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> so Locke I thought this was also why I it. sent you. <laughs> so Locke, Locke can get here as far as his fastest movement is concerned. Okay. I can't give you all directions, so good luck. <laughs> yeah, you, <laughs> you, you stay quiet over there. <laughs> yeah, I can't give you optimal pathing. Sorry. Do the same. I was like, I got an idea where I would say to go. Wait. Guide, yes, guide, my, guide my hand, Nessa. Where do you want him to go? Uh, oh god. So, these lines are where the line of sight is. Mm -hmm. So, like, beyond here, so, like, here would be fine, but here isn't. Correct. 
Okay. Um, do you mind if I just move him? Yeah, go right ahead. Um, also, is this a spot or is that part of the house? That's that's a spot. Okay. We just don't know what's having this guy's going. There's a guy right oh, there. Shit. Oh no, that's oh, a bar. Fuck you. <laughs> never mind, never mind, never mind. Oh, he's, he's, he's inside. inside. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't read the, ta the tag. I'll okay. chuck him here. Uh, uh, I'm guessing the guards will work as like a kind of like player phase, enemy phase, so I can still move and they won't exactly. move. Exactly. You're, you're right, exactly. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, um. I'm gonna play it safe. Um. Uh, I lock um place hey. in a whispery tone. How the fuck do I do something? Um, well, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna roll for your stealth. Oh wait, every time I play? Mm-hmm. Because you're trying to oh, do it without making noise. Oh my uh -huh. god, okay. Uh -huh. it's good. Forty nine hold on. My stealth is twenty-five. Oh no. Great start. Wait, did you fail? Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, okay. you're pretty sure nobody heard you. Okay. And oh, no. e even if it did, you're close enough to the tavern that... <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm, I'm just performing in the tavern. It's fine. It'll be so nice. Uh, Locke rolled a 15 for his stealth check, so he still gets to move oh, out God. normally. Let's go one, two, three, four... I'm assuming you want him to go through the window. <laughs> uh, yeah. He, if he lock picks that door, he's gonna make noise or something. Mm, that's up to his stealth checks. Yeah. Oh shit. Um. Okay. Question: Do the windows have like a slot? Do they open, or will they need to like break it, or is it like just a hole? Like, is there uh, glass? Let him find out. Let me have a, let me uh, have him do a quick check here. Da -da -da. Same. Um, from the outside, Locke does not see a way to open the window. Okay. Um. Hmm. Okay then. I guess he could investigate the door. <laughs> Okay. I don't know. So let's see. He was here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. He has enough movement to do so. Yay. Okay. He's going to check the door. Door, of course, is locked. So let's go for a stealthy roll for seeing if he will lock pick it without causing any alarm. His stealth is a 36. He rolled a 33. The door is unlocked. Mm. Yes. Okay. And he's going to go ahead and just hop on in. <laughs> All right. One last roll for him to see if the plan goes off without a hitch. <laughs> oh my god. This is amazing. Did he rolled work? an 11. <laughs> yes. Yo. <laughs> okay. So now I got to... One, what the fuck? One, one X K of lamp oil. He got it, boys. Oh my hey! god. <laughs> yes. That's Come our here. boy. <laughs> All right. It is now guardsman phase. <laughs> as, we'll, as we'll call oh it. Oh dear god. So he did hear something come from this direction. Oh, of course he did. <laughs> He's gonna one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm. He is currently facing this direction. Okay. So his line of sight is gonna be kinda in a this word sort of way. Right. Yeah. Oh, it's I forgot. It's not just stealth. It's also curfew. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because things have been happening after hours, apparently. Correct. So, yeah. 
Which brings us back to um, Nessa phase, unless you guys want to do anything over here before we go into our second turn. Uh, I can show yeah. Taro the letter. Okay. So yeah. like we can we can take a brief pause for uh, our letter Suspense. showing. Let me, yeah, I'm just waiting for this. Please do. Let me, let me uh, really quickly finish the meditation before I take it. Um, because I have to take this, otherwise I will be sick. Go eat your go eat your pills. I'm, I'm eating my pills right now. I'm literally by the back of my <laughs> Darling. Oh, stealing. I can't read. I thought you said you're not stealing. Um, Excuse me, um, Miss Taro, correct? Yes. I didn't get to properly meet you during the fight. Uh, great work out there, by the way. Sorry our teams are a little, eh. Oh, I saw your fight. You were rather impressive. Uh, <laughs> my, my dad used to be a brawler. That's, uh, you, you know, fighting was his entire shtick. Mm. Uh, so I was trained in it. Um, uh, you you wouldn't happen to know about this letter, uh, would you? And she just kind of gently, like, shows it to her. Okay, and she would take a moment to review the the letter from Prince Siner. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, indeed. In fact, uh, he would be my employer. Oh. I've been I've been looking all over for him in the countryside when you and your band of miscreants showed up. And she just kind of looks to the side and like draw and fucking Saradon and Phoenix kind of goes. Would you be surprised that we actually know where he is? You know where he is. By all means, tell me. I think it would be better if uh, he told you himself, but he kind of left. Yeah. I uh, he's the one who kind of just Wrote went off. back oh, to, okay. yeah. <laughs> That's... The, the drunkard, yeah. Uh, no offense, but are you fucking kidding me? Never I, I didn't believe it it's at first either. This music is perfect for everything. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you just see her go through it, like, doing the thumb twiddle as she, like, I really, like, I'm not good at lying, so I be honest with you here. We didn't believe it at first either, but that man did employ us, so... Uh, and he did call it his castle, and Locke knows him, and that's another employee. Uh, okay. You know what? I'll, I'll ask him when he returns, but mm -hmm. I have no reason to disbelieve you, I suppose. Uh, Considering you have the same letter as I do. Uh, okay. Okay. I promised we'd look for her, so... That's... Well... Consider my steel yours. So long as you are working under the employee of Prince Siner, I have no reason to object. And my fan yours. <laughs> they, just shake, they just shake gently. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and you can go back to your, your stealth over there. Good luck! <laughs> Alright. I feel like, given the circumstance, this was still a better recruitment theme than <laughs> Together We Ride. But yeah. I'm just like, <laughs> no offense, but him? Seriously? <laughs> yeah, no, even, even, even Ringo's like the. Yeah. I know, I know I haven't seen the prince in several years, but like... Uh, he really let himself go! A little bit, a little bit. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Geralt, you said you wanted to talk to Sky. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll just walk up. How are you feeling, Sky? Um... I don't really know what to think, personally. Um, just uh, a lot of stuff happening all at once, and I'm just trying to be brave for it. Okay. It's been a long day, and I know you've been through a lot today. 
you need to step back it is okay do not push yourself any further than you think you need to Ooh, can i have um, a general uh yeah so i am mm. no one saw that. i was just reaching back and forth to my laptop and my phone trying to figure out how to roll uh 41 it's command things 34 nope 41 is what i rolled ah, i see um no i think i'll i think i'll stick with you guys i think that's probably gonna be my best option here i, okay. I still need to learn how to get stronger and um the only way i'm gonna be able to do that is by you know fighting so right it's no all of the stuff that's happening here is new to me as well so <laughs> well, to be honest thanks. seeing things i've never seen before in my life so you're not alone in the chaos of all this well i i still thank you for checking up on me i i, I appreciate it no worries I'll we'll just keep waiting for everyone to get back. <laughs> As you should. <laughs> Nervously. <laughs> Carol just Carol is definitely like pacing back and forth in this area. Just trotting back and forth in the course. I think I don't really I... know. <laughs> <laughs> That's so far being a character of an amnesia. This is all new to me too, I think. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you guys are great. I love y'all. Uh, any other interjections before we proceed? Uh, oh my what's the plan if they don't? If they get caught, should we send someone out to go check in case it's been a while? That'd probably be wise. Are right, you want me to okay. peek my little head out? <laughs> yeah. We, all... right. we, we can give it a little bit, but yeah. Just I'll keep an eye, a lookout the for them or anyone coming to investigate the temple. Yeah, R Ringo kind of just gently ruffles Archie's hair and then <laughs> kind of saying. goes to the door. Go to a quarter, one of that, cut off oh. their hands, we sort it out later. Except my perception is worse than myself. My perception's decent, so. Okay. Right. I have a ba -ba -ba -ba, a twenty-seven in perception. Damn. <laughs> if All not, right. I'll do I'll do my scary baby face. It's fine. Scary baby face. I oh, I know. I know. I know what that one is. <laughs> Do you, know, do you know what the scary baby face is? What? <laughs> I should uh, know. I should know. I don't know why I was surprised. Okay. Yep. Anyway. Uh, I have a 40 in charm and a 30 set four in command. Jesus. So. So what do you do? And a 25 and do you want me to look out now or do you want me to wait? I, that is entirely up to you, dude. What are you asking I'm me not, for? I'm, I'm just. I just. I just said someone know. should keep an eye of if it takes. If if it. You feel yeah, it's been a I'll, while. Someone should check. Yeah, I'll wait. But. I'll give it another round and see how they do. Okay. 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 Hmm. Oh shit! Yeah. Um. That's you. <laughs> I'm thinking. Um, let's see. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Four, five, six. <laughs> ah! All right. Um. They definitely, by the way, are going to hear us explode something, and we are going to be yelling <laughs> up. It'll be yes. fine. I mean, if we rush in and then... Lock the door know. behind... Close the door behind us? Yeah, let's That's true. We have to let it air out, too. So... Mm, 
Oh wait, am I gaining XP from these performances? You are. By the way, yes. You are. Okay. You're performing. Uh, it still counts. Okay, hold on. I need to give myself twenty then, because I did that twice. Um. Oh wait, I need a roll for it as well. <laughs> hold up. Mm-hmm. Um. I'm playing dice game. I need to roll dice. <laughs> You're in a very um, precarious position, there, Miss. <laughs> I am in it. Wait. Oh hmm. Yeah. Hold on. Maybe I should. Hmm. There's not many places to hide, that's the problem. We were, Locke was here. <laughs> I didn't intend to turn this into a stealth map, but here we are. <laughs> it's funny as fuck, I'll take it. You know what, fuck it, I'm in now. I'm... We're it's... in the paint. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Oh no. No! Okay, <laughs> uh, okay. well, you, you, right. you perform for him. Yep. You're pretty um, sure nobody heard you. I, I'm pretty sure. I, I don't know that. And then, I guess... Uh, reminder, um, this is mm -hmm. somewhere. Okay. Correct. That is... That is we're, we're calling that a space. Okay. Oh there my go. god. That's a clever idea. Hello. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and roll for his stealth. Okay. <laughs> And now we get the, uh, I guess, not quite enemy phase, but, you know, guardsman phase. Yeah. Call it. Yellow phase. Yellow phase. <laughs> this is my turn. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I know you aren't from around here, but what are you doing up past curfew? Oh, uh, I'm so sorry, sir. Um, I... See, I'm a traveling performer, um, and I kind of like lost my way to the tavern. Um, I've been, I've been just trying to fumble around the dark, and I, I couldn't find anything. And I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Let me think. Can I have you roll me an intelligence check for lying to this guy? Uh, sure. I'm getting cerebral. Oh, shit. What's my intelligence? <laughs> I'm glad Ringo didn't go across this because Ringo would just be like, uh, uh, <laughs> uh 22. Um, and I got a 44. Right. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, considering that the tavern is right behind you, <laughs> he doesn't, you know, believe your story. Completely. But here's, but here's what he's gonna do. He's going to go ahead and escort you manually oh. to the tavern. <laughs> You're picked up by the scruff of your neck, just waddles over there. Just like, all right, get on the horse. Come on. Counterpoint, it's dark. <laughs> counterpoint, it is dark. He's trying to protect you. <laughs> okay, fine. Does your a... counterpoint is my counterpoint. Mr. God damn it, okay. <laughs> Start coughing Locke... really loudly to let Locke know to get behind the building. <laughs> oh yeah, no, he's he's hiding. Yeah, no, he's still just, I'm he the one that best. got caught. I'm a sacrifice. And hey, it's getting the guard to strike. Oh, true. Do you think Ringo would have seen that through the door? <laughs> so he kind of just manually puts you in the tavern. <laughs> Go to your room. Over. Go I to your room. I just looked over and went, damn. Yeah, I just like at the bar. And he's like, uh -huh. just like he just like kind of like watches you as you come in, but he doesn't say anything. Nessa's head is kind of hanging down like, oh. It's just a disappointed father look. I'm going to do a quick roll for eyes really quick for a second. I want to make sure that I, oh, no. I'm playing him correctly. Okay, okay. <laughs> No, no, we're gonna get we're gonna get to these two later. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! And I'm gonna do a quick roll for lock as well. Okay. And he's gonna return to his post. Oh, 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 Okay, his line of sight. Actually, no, hang on, I'm doing that wrong. Excuse me. 
he is going to be kind of watching this general direction here. Oh, which yeah, I don't blame him. You kind of is being kind of like... So I'm just going to like show which tiles can be seen by him. Okay. More or less. Yeah, that makes okay. sense. So yeah, yeah. That's, that's this general field of view here. Oh wait, hang on. Let me just these tiles also. Yeah. Okay. He's kind of like keeping an eye on the the general area of the tavern, essentially. <laughs> well, but he's still at his post. I'm just you know, <clears throat> in the back. Okay. <laughs> It'll be fine. It will be fine. I just like the idea of eyes. Just. <laughs> Really? Oh, yeah, I have to deal with my boss. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're gonna do another movement for Locke. Uh, oh. Squish, you can't move Nessa anymore, unfortunately. I'm sorry for that. That, that is fair. Unless, after we get through Eyes' talk with you, you wanna you, you wanna try sculpting your way out and back to the temple? You can certainly try, but we're gonna have a little okay. scene with you two later. Let's start off with this all. That's mm, mm, you got that. We'll talk later. <laughs> but yeah, you can go ahead and move lock, and I'll go ahead and do his rolls and such. Okay. Um, making absolute sure. So these spaces are fine. Mm -hmm. It's just okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Door. That's enough to get him to the entrance. Right, right. Oh, just thank looking over fuck. with. Where's Nesta? Where's Yo, Nesta? Got the goods. Cool. Where is He doesn't give a shit. Just you lost you lost the bar. Did she get caught? Didn't lose her. I know exactly right. where she is. Alright. Fair enough. I don't have the the balls to say otherwise, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. So I guess we don't have the bard with us in here anymore. Uh, cool. <laughs> at, at the moment, no. I, no, I'd assume not at the moment, but we have the keg, so that's cool. I mean, as long as she's safe, it's fine. <laughs> oh, I'm sure she's safe. <laughs> right, Locke? She's safe. Okay, Good. then we're fine. <laughs> yep. She's a little um indisposed at the moment, but she's fine. Oh. Yeah, she's probably oh. safer than we're going to be here in a minute. <laughs> I, mean, yeah. I like you. I like you. <laughs> yeah, given the fact we are about to make the loudest fucking noise known to man, and just Ringo goes up, stands It's up, underground in a stone structure. It'll be fine. Hey, you seem like the powder keg kind of type. Where do you want me to set this up, sir? Uh, give me just a second here. Anyone got a rag or something we can I use as a fuse? <sighs> Ringo kind of takes off the scarf and just tosses it at Zeradon. Just I mean, we can use a scarf if you really want. I was just, I don't know. I don't, got like... I don't have like. What do you want me to do? Rip my clothes? No, I'm just wondering if anyone had just like spare clothing in their packs or something. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I I travel light, so. I, I also travel light. All right, Scarpa shall be. Okay. All right. And you'll just see you? Ringo going. Oh. Mm, oh. All right. Well, Girl tucks his scarf away. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> his wife probably made that for him. You really want him to burn that? I I just need something flammable. I don't care what it is yeah. or how sentimental Ringo, it is. Just give me look, something. This isn't sentimental to Ringo. Don't worry. Okay. Now. Do we have anyone magical here who can start a spark? Or do uh, I need to do that manually? I, I, I've got fire magic. I've got thunder magic. Okay, can you cast that fire magic without, like, torching everyone in the hall here? Uh, yes. Like, can you do it in a minimal scale? I, I, I'm, I'm not too... Okay, out of character here, I'm not too sure how volatile magic is in Fire Emblem. <laughs> um, it can it be. Basically, it, it basically affects its range. Like... It's hard to explain, but essentially a fireball would take up this section of area if she is aiming for that spot. Okay, so we can't so like, just like... Five foot so we can't. 
And okay, so we can't just flop it for someone to like have a spark of fire from their fingertips or something like that. Uh, I'm willing to bend the rules a little bit. Uh, it's like, if not, I do have an alternative solution. I'm just asking because it'd be more reliable than what I have in mind. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> as far as Fire Emblem standards go, like I'm standing here, I could hit a like here, here, mm -hmm. here. <laughs> yeah. So, like, if we, say, put the fuse here, the barrel here, and then shut the door, it'd be fine. Oh. Yeah, Ringo's spell is was... pretty long. It's about her body length. <laughs> oh, I, I was just planning on taking the barrel, popping open the top, putting in the scarf as a, you know, as a fuse, lighting the other end, and then rolling it down the stairs, close the door, and just wait for the Molotov to go off. That's funnier. That's that way is... funnier. <laughs> That's way funnier to do with. <laughs> Okay. So, oh my but god. Can we use a fire magic for that or do I need to go with the alternative solution to That is I will allow stuff. fire magic to be used for that. Yeah, I, okay. I could yeah, like I could I could I assume I could control the fire magic enough that that should be fine. Yeah. <laughs> Small which, 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 burst, you're fine. Yeah, we just need a spark. <laughs> Cuz otherwise I was going to just, you know, take my armor gauntlet and start punching the wall. <laughs> very very rudimental flint and steel. I, you're not wrong. Yeah. I am the flint and steel. <laughs> I am the stone man. <laughs> Alright, so is there any issue setting up our rolling bomb here? By all means. I awesome. think we've made Locke the giddiest he's been in a while. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. he's thrilled. <laughs> He's just well, like, uh... speak now, forever hold your peace. <laughs> Fire Backing hole. up. <laughs> Backing, up. Backing up. Backing up. Backing up. Backing up. Lock, Sky. All right. Sky, Archie. <laughs> Back it up a little bit, please. I I physically can't move them. I am I am I am I am stuck in the flick animation. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Do. That's oh, yeah, all right. Thank you. Someone has to close the door, so you are the biggest oh. man and have the highest AC. So this is my fucking idiot idea. <laughs> I guess I'll close the door then. No, no, I, I, I got it. No, oh, I thought you were saying someone needs to close. Ah. No, I'll close it. All I right. I love how Gerald is like idea. trying to white knight the white knight. <laughs> You guys crack me up. All right. I thought uh, fire in the things. hole in three, two, one. Boom. Oh, perfect roll. That was beautiful. Rolling. We don't have an explosion, though. Um, <laughs> so, um. Hang on, oh, I got it. I got it. All that work for a dead. We, we, really we don't really have a big explosion, I'm sorry. But, uh. There you go. Uh, there. Yes. Okay, that'll work. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking fine. Boom. Okay. All right. I'm going to really quick roll for damage. Mm -hmm. As we just hear Zaradon putting his arms against the door, like, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> hey, I got a question, Zaradon. Um, yeah. Can I have you roll me a defense roll, please? Just a oh, d20. No! Oh, a d20? Mm hmm. All right. Got a night. Yep. You, you okay, so Zeradon, um, des describe to me kind of just how you're holding the door back here. Oh, I. Well, which way does the door open? Does it like open towards this direction? Oops, sorry, wrong thing. Um, this direction or this direction? Uh, this way. Okay, so yeah, I'm just closing, like T posing with my back <laughs> to it, just like <laughs> just leaning back on it. <laughs> All, All right. right. You definitely feel the impact of the explosion against the door. Um, but the door holds fast, and so do you. Okay. Now we just... Now we just wait a minute. Let them burn. Let the smoke clear. <laughs> well, the, the idea is to, to burn out the oxygen in the room. Right. Assuming that whatever the sludge is requires oxygen, but it, you know, right. um, it's some sort of biological carbon-based creature, so it needs some sort of, yeah. 
But anyway, or it could be a magic, and this could be for nothing. But you know, still. So, I'm gonna kind of set the stage once you guys open the door to to like show you what you guys are seeing. So I'll I'll have you guys just determine how long you want to wait. Uh, I could give it a, a minute or two, yeah. Yeah, just a couple minutes. <laughs> yeah, you all can come out of your hidey holes. Yeah. That's I think strange. I think Phoenix is the most excited to see the damage too. Fringo just kind of stood there and was like, "So, whose idea was the lantern oil? Because that was a good idea." Not gonna I lie, I'm shit, thrilled. I'm, I'm <laughs> glad you're thrilled because I'm thrilled. Is it okay to be thrilled in this situation? Because that was the best use of that scarf I have ever done. Honestly, this might I be the first damage that I'm excited to see. <laughs> I mean, it, it was y'all said there were skeletons in these barrels, yeah? Well, no, there was there was like um, a living type of sludge almost it, it should be fine i'm sure it's fine but yeah they burst out and merged together so if we, yeah it's probably not a good idea though to sit or stand by the door over on the other end because i don't want to know what happens when that uh guard sees us in here wait which store are you talking about the the store Okay, that's yeah. Taro, you might want to move away from that, hun. Uh, yeah, that is actually an interesting point. How loud was that? <laughs> so, as far as sound is concerned, we're just gonna say that pretty much anyone within. Wait, hang on. How do I? How do I? Hang on. Shit. Within Sorry. like this radius. <laughs> I'm gonna say we'll we'll like near it. <laughs> All right. I think we need to go in. So you guys are having the conversation in the, in the background. I, I, I feel like it would be more than a sound at that point, too. Like yeah. it, would, it would be like a it'd be a, a rumble. Also. Like there, the, yeah, there there was a shock wave of some kind. We might be getting reinforcements or more enemies. <laughs> we should probably go in. Or we should probably go in. However, yeah. before you go in, I need to get told off. <laughs> I love how you said it, before you go in, my music faded out. <laughs> oh, so did mine. Yeah, same. How are you? How? How does this keep happening? One second. I'm just adjusting the uh, <laughs> effect for the fire here. I love that. That means this motherfucker is getting told off, and we and just eyes. Here's the kaboom. <laughs> I'm the one at the high school party who got caught with the booze. So we're gonna roll back about ten minutes time wise when Nessa just got Brock into the into the um awesome. the tavern. Mm -hmm. uh, hi, sir. <laughs> you got you got you know essentially put into a a into the tavern here, what would you do immediately? <laughs> um, now, before you say anything, sir, um, it was a process of elimination between who was the sneakiest besides Locke. I just happened to be the sneakiest. Uh, it was situational. Uh -huh. And I just smile. <laughs> <laughs> you were like a child being caught with their hand in the cookie jar. <laughs> yeah. Can I just, you know, have you do another charm roll? <laughs> oh, charm, okay. <laughs> oh. Because you're not lying to him. You're just trying to not get in trouble. <laughs> yeah. 68, what's my... Oh, my charm is 69. My touch. Yeah. Oh, God. Um, oh, fuck's sake, yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Man, my bad so... luck has rubbed off. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Vulcan. <laughs> What on earth is that gif you just posted? Oh, I, I understand. I know what's going on there. Never yeah. <laughs> Kaboom. Uh, he just kind of <laughs> folds his arms for a minute. He's like, he's like, you can tell that he's like trying to think of what to say. 
even though he's like a couple of cups deep now. <laughs> oh, good, he's drunk. I can whittle him down. He he he's not like drunk drunk, but like uh, you know he's he's had a he couple. hasn't eaten today. <laughs> oh oh yeah. <laughs> so he's he's a little tipsy. Look, I appreciate the idea of where this is coming from. You're trying to do good for people. You're trying to help out. Um, morally speaking, it's not good to steal. It never will be, never has been, but these are desperate times that we're in. I'm not gonna lie. Um, we just gotta be really, really fucking careful about what we do. This country has been nothing but nice to our refugees. Um, or about as nice as it can be, I guess, given the circumstances. Um, we are not at war with these people. I don't want to be at war with these people. We don't exactly have an army. We have, what, 12 guys at best? Um, <laughs> shush. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You're fine. <laughs> and I get it. I, I totally get it. You want to help out the most amount of people, but uh, just be careful. All right? I don't want to lose anybody in this cause any more than you do. <clears throat> uh, that's what we kind of like. Um, you know that kind of like look a child has when they're like being told off like that kind of like uh but like she kind of gets it like she does understand um uh of course sir um i uh, i am sorry i i didn't want to cause harm um if it helps we did pay for the damage not the damage we did pay for the the lamp oil um it's not great that we broke in uh, but we're trying to do this as morally as possible, and we don't want to cause any issues. I, I guess the explosion wouldn't have happened at this point, so I don't know if it's any yeah. issues. <laughs> so, um, we, we don't want to cause harm. Sorry, sir. Right, just... <sighs> Too late for this shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, it's Church. like 1am at this point. Mm -hmm. uh, he's he's very tired. He hasn't gone to sleep yet. He's basically been on edge since he left Ramo. <sighs> I trust you. Uh, for whatever it's worth, whatever this plan is, I trust you. I just want no involvement in it. I understand. And that's when I... you hear a massive explosion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> trust you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I trust you that much. <laughs> um, so first thing you would uh, immediately notice is <laughs> candles are being lit. People are going outside looking like around at the explosion. <laughs> so now we've got... Just... Go, 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 go. Get in there, get in there. Everyone, now, pilot, now, pilot. Now we've got the guard trying to like talk to the townsfolk as to what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Quick, Blitzkrieg, turn to chaos. <laughs> uh, it just kind of looks at you. <laughs> <laughs> it's and... just that nervous... Uh, Nessa kind of just smiles and is like, okay, I, I don't possess fire nor explosions. The explosion was not me. Oh no, I know I'm it wasn't here. you directly. <laughs> You have an alibi. I'm not mad at you. I'm not mad at you. Oh, fight the goddess. <laughs> oh, f uh, fucking hell. Come on. I'm gonna just drag by her arm. <laughs> hey, you just can I, see can I have you? Head. Can I have you both give me a stealth roll, please? Oh, One last side. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay. okay, I succeed. He rolled a 22. He's got like a 30 in stealth. Oh, for God's sake! 71. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna say that for all intents and purposes, you were riding um, uh, side saddle on the back of his horse. Just kind of oh. said, come on, and you're with him. 
So my God. I'm gonna I'm gonna let you kind of ride his coattails for stealth. Thank you. Because I it's think like it's this funny. En this entire okay. time, Ark's just been vibing outside. <laughs> yeah, Ark is. I don't know where he is. He's over there. Ark's right here. He's over on the bench. <laughs> He's over on the bench. I'm sure there's some ruffled feathers at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, he's most likely just trying to calm his mountain down. Just relax, relax, relax. Hey. What's up, guys? What in the goddess's name are you doing out here? Liberation! Want and destruction? At that point, I would open the door. <laughs> I don't even know what to make you roll for that. Uh... Everything and nothing. I like, I like the idea of he just sees Ringo's bare fucking neck and goes. He <laughs> <laughs> just like he's exasperated. He just like throws his hands up in the air. He's like, all right, fine. For Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Squishy, can I just have you, like, retell me how much gold you gave Log really quick? I gave uh, it was gold. Ringo that gave the money. Oh, right, sorry, I Ringo, gave... how much? I gave him a hundred. You gave him a hundred gold? Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Just making sure. Yeah, it was fifty, and I said, no, we're paying extra. <laughs> I just wanted you to... Oh, excuse me. Yeah. just wanted to confirm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, first things first, when, <laughs> when you get into the room... It just smells like smoke and ash and soot and just holy smokes. Um, <laughs> holy smokes. Any, any remnant of any barrels is just reduced to ash. Okay. Reduced to items. Good job. Like it's a, it's a smoldering wreckage in here, but there's no more flame. Okay. Um, <laughs> love the smell of lantern napalm at one in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the, the the horrible stench that was in the air, it's gone. <laughs> Placed by a new, different, horrible stench. Liberty! It smells like it's liberty! Yeah. It smells like burning fucking barrels, but yeah. And copper, so blood, and... <laughs> Alright, so, um... That is currently all you see. It's just a bunch of ash, smoke, and rubble in this room. We, we, right, well. we should probably get in that room, though, before they yeah. they get into this area. So, uh, pile in, pile in, pile in, pile in. <laughs> pile in. <laughs> Do I have to I feel like it? Jane. I feel like Jamie's just like, this is disrespectful to the church, and you know it. <laughs> oh, he's, he's, he's having a bad time. <laughs> Yeah. Did you see? You see? You see? Poor Ringo going. I know who's <laughs> because she feels bad about this because this is a church and she grew up in a religious place. But did your church sacrifice people? Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, lost Ringo. <laughs> the Eminem of power is glowing. Is it? Yeah, look at it's, it's the oh, glow yeah. from the fire around it. Uh, <laughs> oh, it, it is. Reflecting. I was like, whoa! I was like, whoa! It's going super sick. <laughs> because it, uh, like the fire is also casting shadows of our tokens. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wait, hang on. Is oh, it still yeah. casting fire like on these pieces or? Yeah. Yeah, everything yeah. is on fire it still. Sh shouldn't be. These. These two aren't. These are all. Uh, on all fire. of them are lit for oh, me. Oh, and this one. Oh, interesting. This this is the only one not lit for me. Oh, only four of them are lit, lit and for four me. of them are. Wow, it's it's different for everyone. These four are lit for me. Yeah, I think I think they're all lit. This well, the they're all off. Lit. They're all supposed to be off. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can we just throw them into like a bag or something to make them stop? You know what? We'll just kind of. The fire happens anyway. There we go. Let me just that one. That one stays. Okay. okay. It's, it's a, it's a plot relevant. Everybody plot. out! <laughs> you, you stay. It's a plot time. You, you closed the door, right, Saradon? Uh, you guys were all behind me. Geralt, you closed <laughs> the door, right, bud? 
Yeah. <laughs> also, we all should be back up to. Oh no, y'all took damage last map, right? Never mind. I took. If I recall right, we did yep. take some time to heal. I just don't remember who yeah. all got healed. I, I, I got not. Uh, <laughs> I'm still a little dinged, but nothing to worry about. Yeah. <sighs> so, the what's the map of this door? Of this door? Yeah. It's locked. Go. We incinerated the key on the. Oh, wait, did we have a key still that one? I feel like Ringo's just kind of looking through some of the ash. What do you mean we have a key? We have a thief. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why are we. I do. But we have a magic key. We don't, just work yeah, the magic doors? the the magic key was for the door up here that didn't have a fucking door <laughs> hinge or anything. Not only that, but Locke has the magic key. I thought it was a skeleton key. That's what I was wondering. That's Zelda. No, well, because we got um, it from a skeleton. <laughs> oh. No, it was called magic key specifically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, to, to to quote some other video game terminology, it would be called a key item. Mm -hmm. And, oh and only had use on that one door. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Ringo's just kind of staring at the flame next to her. <laughs> we should probably uh, have Locke unlock the door. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. Yeah. Would you do that for us a lot, please and thank you? Yeah. <laughs> Make it through, just let me know. Oh, right. uh, just to scooch over just a little bit there, boss. Thank you. Yep. So, should I switch back to the chaos music now, or...? <laughs> uh, you can now hit the button. Oh, I can hit the button. Mm-hmm. I'm you excited for that. Button. Everyone can now hit the secret button. Where, oh. where was it? Where is it? Uh, there it is. See. Oh, it's this one. Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Mm. Hey. Oh, with little Absolutely effort, the door, of course, is unlocked because Locke is just that good. He's a, he's a thief. Thank you. Mm -hmm. mm. What you see before you is a narrow corridor that branches off into two paths. Um, you do, of course, see some bookshelves on either path another couple of chests, and two barrels. Well... Well, yep. Well. Let's see, are we going in initiative order, or what are we doing here? Yeah, we can go in initiative order. It's yep. been Squishy's turn for like an hour, so there you go. Yeah. Oh yeah, whoops. I <laughs> had to switch back at some point and forgot. Oh no, okay. it's, it's fine. I think it's fine. All right, so original plan. I'm going to attack this barrel instead now. You're just going to go ahead and attack <laughs> it. Yep. Okie dokie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, and I, I am going to use my thunder magic. All right. What's your magic stuff? Oh, oh. My magic is 11. 11. Okay. Make your roll. Sorry, fixing something on my character sheet. Okay. Uh, one, two, one, two, two. 82. Okay. Ooh. What's your speed, just so I know? My speed is 9. Okay, make another attack. Okay. Fifty. Nice. You said it. your magic is 11? My magic is 11. All right. Awesome. So you send two powerful jolts of thunder magic through this barrel. The barrel shakes and shudders and does, in fact, explode into a pile of goo, similar to the ones that you saw before. I figured. <laughs> when the goo reemerges, however... You can see the figure of a, well, a, a humanoid-shaped figure mm -hmm. appears. Mm. But, like, looks, like, really worse for wear. Like, you did a number on him, like he wasn't expecting you to show up this early. 
Okay. Um, let me see. You hit twice. Ba -ba 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 -ba. One second. You level four, right? Yes. Gain ten experience for that. Okay. Cool. Oh, but before we proceed too much farther, I, I do want to dole out some fun experience for everybody. Oh. Uh, mm. Energy experience, energy experience, energy experience. Let's see. Starting from, I guess, turn order. Uh, Phoenix, for helping come up with the idea of destroying the room early with Zeradon, go ahead and gain 150 energy EXP. Ditto for Zeradon for coming up with the plan. So it was 150? Mm hmm. An extra 150 for you, okay. sir. Da, 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 da. Ringo. Mm -hmm. For making some sacrifices as far as your own self is concerned by spending gold and sacrificing aesthetics for the sake of this mission, and coming up with the stealth mission to obtain the lamp oil with Zeradon, also gain 150 energy experience. Uh, Geralt? Cool. Let me think. I'm trying to think what, like, you participated in on this whole thing. For checking up on, on your party members during a time of crisis, gain 100 energy experience. Mm. Ditto for Ringo, oh. for checking up on your party members in a time of crisis. 100 oh. for you. Okay. 100? Mm -hmm. Okay. Nessa. Yes. For participating in the spell in the stealth mission and assisting Locke with uh, successfully obtaining the lamp oil and then having a major uh, emotional moment with your boss, gain two hundred energy experience. Hey. Okay. Yay. Uh, we're also going to go okay. ahead and give Locke some extra energy experience as well for you know being kind of the catalyst for this whole thing. He's also going to gain uh, two hundred energy experience. Good job. Yeah, he helped. Also, perfect timing. I'm seeing the people playing tabletop thing pop up. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is no. Really also, do our brief pause because I can almost guarantee you that it's going to crash any minute. Yep. Yep. <laughs> so, uh, now would yep. be a good time to switch. <laughs> Bio break. Your Go energy. ahead and update your energy experience as you need to, but, uh. <laughs> in fact, I already spent mine. Did you? Same. I need 50 more, then I can spend some. <laughs> well, actually, I need yeah, more. Yeah, the, but... the 150 was exactly what I needed to be able to spend it and what I wanted to do. Hell yeah. Perfect. I'm starting to think I should it, put think... more stealth. Let's hold on to it. I don't want to make intimidation. That's fair. Yeah, you don't, you don't want uh, somehow oh, right Ringo to be the intimidating one in the group. <laughs> That's a baby. No. Oh, I just realized that Eyes also still has a bunch of energy experience that he needs to spend. I should probably do that at some point. Oh, yeah. I just wonder how many Eyes sessions for dealing it's going to be for... Eyes, we're dealing with the team's bullshit Hmm? Oh, I was just going to say, I wonder how many sessions it'll take for Zerdon to keep on plowing forward until something finally stops him. And kills him. <laughs> I mean, it was close I mean, we... last time. Mm hmm Yeah. Is that your goal, to see when you die? <laughs> I mean, not necessarily, but... Cool. It's on the back of your mind, I guess. It's just... Yeah, I don't think about it. That's how I've been playing a lot of my characters lately in different RPGs. It's just like, make a really tough bastard and then just keep on face-tinking everything until something finally takes them out. I'm sure there's some deeper level stuff in that, but we won't go there yet. Yeah, I'm not a therapist. I don't want to be a therapist. Trust me. No, you don't. Nah, yeah, no one needs to do bullshit. Mm -hmm. But I like you. You're a cool guy. I like your funny words, Magic Man. <laughs> The only thing magic about me is that I managed to get the negative magic stat. 
Oh no, I did that. I did negative strength last character sheet I made. Oh yeah. Yeah, she had negative two strength. <laughs> I like. <laughs> I like how Ark is just kind of like, or no, Robin is just kind of like reacting in the comments, just like with that Megatron. What? <laughs> no context at all. He doesn't know there's a whole stealth mission going on and an explosion. Yes, explosions are the best result to stealth missions. Oh, I like how I suddenly have points with Zeradon. <laughs> yeah, you've had a few. Why do you consider that? But, you know, helping with his funny plan kind of uh, got you up there a bit more. Let me see where I am with Locke. Only, only one boy only with Locke? What? I mean, you just gave him money. You enabled his uh, his tendencies. You didn't you didn't really go out to help him. True. I like and how Ark work. doesn't have any points with any of the NPCs, really. Who? Uh, Ark. Oh, oh yeah, he doesn't. Not really. I found retrospective. I don't ever actually check to see if Locke actually did leave the money behind as bland, or if he just pocketed it. <laughs> I was waiting for I, someone to mention that. Yeah, I was gonna ask. <laughs> yeah, I was about like, to I, go look in back. In the back of my it. head, I was like, he's just gonna keep it anyway. Yeah. And you see where you <laughs> kind of turn around, Law. Did you, uh. Did you, uh, actually give them the money? <laughs> Silence. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. What kind of role do you want to make to uh, to ask him the question? Because <laughs> depending on what you do, I'm gonna do something really funny. <laughs> okay. Oh. Try to figure out what would be my best bet. Mm-hmm. Uh. Charm ain't gonna get me shit in this conversation. Um, Are you sure? Sure. Fuck it. Charm him. Okay. Just like lead up to him, like you, you did like, uh, like you, you just see like her walk up and go. So lock. Mm hmm. She actually leave the money. Kind of, <laughs> kind of prominent that she did. <laughs> Make the roll. Sixty-six. I get have forty. You failed. Ah. Yeah, just barely. Okay. He hands you fifty gold. <laughs> God. Damn it, <laughs> Keep it. You sure? Yeah, it's yours. Shrugs and I never saw it. Gold again. Like, you just see her kind of give that smug look of, I used to be a mischievous cat. Pocket it. Keep it. You're it's a cat? Yours. What? Just, <laughs> this is the first time it'd be your ink. Yeah. I'm, huh. uh, just her kind of standing there. Oh, yeah. I... I forget that you don't probably know that. All right, well, eh, yeah, I'll lagu, half lagus. Huh. Love story. You'll meet my dad. <laughs> that sounds like a threat. Um, uh... You can keep your dad right where he is. Thanks. I'll be over here and yeah, not no, that's... meet him. That seems yeah, um... probably <clears throat> he's scary. No, he scares me. I um, so yeah. I mean, I wasn't going to be intimidated by the man. I'm not scared of him, per se. I'm just saying I'm not going to be meeting your parents in any capacity because that's not... No, Violet. No. Yeah, no, no. No, we're not fair. Mm -hmm. No. We're good. Just, uh, we're good. you know, just, 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 just. Yeah. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna be over yeah. here. And, um... Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. You just see Rigger kind of just sit there and look at the party and just look at, like... <laughs> Phoenix and give her the shrug and kind of look like. You guys crack me up. <laughs> I'll tell you, he probably didn't pay full price for it. Ugh. He knows that a he knows that a, uh, a keg of lamp oil is worth. He left the fifty uh -huh. gold there. Yep. Or at least he offered you fifty gold back. Mm -hmm. Come back. Why? Welcome back. He offered. Wait. So the top didn't go down. Nope. I, I guess not. Has not gone yeah. down yet. What blasphemy is this? 
I like the idea. Break. <laughs> I, I like the idea though of just him, just with the smug face, like here's your fifty back, air <laughs> keeper. <laughs> Soloff may or may have not paid full price, or may have not pocketed it. I don't know. It's up for interpretation. And it's up for interpretation. I'm going to assume he probably did. Probably paid the fifty, maybe. <laughs> um, okay, Nessa was too far away from the shop to confirm nor deny. Uh -huh, yeah, you uh -huh. Yeah, no one knows. So <laughs> the only person who knows is Locke. And uh -huh. we don't know, and we don't know because you failed that check. Yep. <laughs> we were checking to see if Locke spent the money. Oh. No, yeah. My brain ends. Is it yeah, my course. turn then? Or are we? Yeah. Waiting still. Might might as well continue taking turns while we're waiting for it to crash. Yeah. <laughs> might as well. Oh yeah. Immediately crashes my One. HP. One, two, two, four, five, six, seven. I'm a slash at the monk. Okay. Go ahead and what is your strength? Strength is nine. Okay. This will probably kill it if you succeed, so. Uh, 54. 54? Okay, it doesn't even matter. I didn't even, uh, don't even check. 90. Oh so yeah, it does five damage, and Monk dies. Yay! Dissolves back into a puddle of sludge. Cool. Well, that one was easier. <laughs> You're both level three, so for the kill, gain 30 experience. Cool. All right. It was easier because you didn't let it have a turn. Yep. It's... And that's why I wanted to preemptive strike. Yep. All right. Well, now that we're not worrying about um, them combining. I'm still worried about the fire. Why? It's just There's a little one. One, two, three. Probably should have snuffed it out. But... Also, I'm pretty sure it wasn't actually a fire by the point we got to it. God because it was it. described as not being on fire, and hey, that's why hey we guys. had the whole discussion of the thing still being lit. <laughs> hey, hey guys, mouse over the fire. I love doing that. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> oh, oh, come on. We might have <laughs> I said it was plot Oops. relevant fire. <laughs> I mean, hey, they need I to be feel safe so. in case Locke died in five seconds. We got to took us together. We're we're just casing the new room before we, you go. Yeah, that, yeah, that's what it is. Don't mm -hmm. worry about. It. Mm -hmm. Well, <laughs> I shall attempt to cleave this barrel with me axe. Okay, what's your strength? Strength with the axe turns out to be thirteen. Nice. Uh, and your speed also, just so I know. Speed is three. Okay, go ahead and make a single attack. Okay. Uh, what am I trying to roll here? Uh, what's your accuracy? Uh, 85 on the axe. Okay. Uh, go ahead and make your roll. I'll let you know if you're successful or not. Okay, yeah, 64. Yeah, that works. You said strength is 13? Yes. Cool. So, uh, the barrel pretty much shatters on on impact with your weapon. As you as you do so, the sludge coalescing inside reforms into the form of a guy. Mm -hmm. And is a little bit stunned <laughs> by just being cleaved in twain and having to reform itself. Mm -hmm. But you did take out half of its HP in one shot, so there you go. Oh. Oh, that's why. Whoa. Are you reading that skill? Yeah. Yeah. Because I don't think we had that typed out the last time I ever saw it. Oh, no. There have been a lot of different revamps to the story as 
as a, yeah. a combat thing as well. So don't worry, mm -hmm. I'm thinking of things as they happen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is going to be hard mode. It's going to be a little bit harder than the last time, and I'm not going to throw my punches as much as I used to. Or pull my punches. What's the word? What's the phrase? I forgot. Pull your punches? Um, Damn, yeah, yeah. You you really want to use that phrase here of all places where that happened? I might. Whoa. Okay. Fair. All right. Ouch. Carry on. Oh. I guess I forgot to hit that. Uh... I'm telling. <laughs> Ringo kind of looks at it. Yeah, it doesn't look good. Well, uh, I'm going to put that out of its misery. So I'm going to use my horse spirit. Which okay. is the first time I'm getting to actually use that. Um. Oh, fuck. Hang on. I almost forgot something. Uh, zero down for attacking gain 10 experience. Or wait, no. I need to double check the actual amount there. Three on three, right? Should be ten. Yeah, it's ten. Me, uh, you want me to roll for damage? You can attack him. Yeah. I am attacking. Okay. What is your magic? My magic is a ten. Okay. And this guy's resistance, if I recall, was a six. All right. And your accuracy? Uh, seventy. All right, you're aiming for a fifty-nine or better to attack. Correct. Mm -hmm. Uh, ba -ba -ba. thirty-five. Hey, that hits. Nice. All right, so you deal four damage to the monk. So thirteen minus four brings him to the nine. What's your speed? It is a 12 because of the speed ring. Okay, so true. This also grants me a plus because I'm using this weapon now. Technically, does that actually give me all of the effect plus three effects now? Let me take a look at your weapon really quick. See what you're talking yep. about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's just a while it's equipped, it gives you those things. Okay, so that brings me to a six on the. Uh, the Three in dexterity, a three in defense, uh, three in resistance, mm -hmm. and a three. Yep, deck speed, def res. You're good. Yep. So you do have enough speed to go ahead and double this guy. So make your second attack. Okie dokie. Uh, ba -ba -ba. 10. Okay. Well, looking at your crit chance, though, unfortunately, you don't have enough to get that crit, so. Mm -mm, mm -mm. That's still another four. I'll whittle him down a little bit. Yeah, you're getting there. Uh, does, so, does that count as another one? Because I've never actually gotten to hit a second time like that until now. So, it's still 10 experience for the encounter. Okay, but is it another weapon usage? Yes. Okay. Uh, so that's 10 per per hit, or per just one encounter? Uh, 10 experience for one encounter, but you do get the extra weapon experience. Okay. So that's 19, and the extra weapon experience would be, okay. Mm-hmm. Do, 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 do. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, I'm rusty. It's been a while. <laughs> Fine. Go ahead, Nessa. All right, um, I position myself in a very awkward spot. I can't reach any of you guys. Yeah. <laughs> nice one. You can have uh, NPCs just... move. Well, actually, lock open the door so you could probably perform for him. Correct. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That chest. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Hey, lock. Um, getting a lot of experience in him today. Was... Yeah, I'm at like tw I'm in the twenties with him. That's crazy to me. Um, that was a fucking heist. Um, <laughs> yeah, sorry you got caught like that, though, but um, thanks for distracting the guards so I could sneak away. Nice work. It, it, thank you. It's no problem. Um, I'm glad to have been of service. Um, didn't think a, a bard could be stealthy, but hey, the art of performing is knowing when to shut up as well. 
<laughs> nice. Thank you. All right. Um, lock and move again. And All then right. I guess the rest of the NPCs can go. True enough. Let's think here. Well, this could be funny. You go immediately oh. here. Oh, he's going to that one. All right. Oh. This could be funny. And it was. So <laughs> this, this monk has four defense. Locke has nine dexterity. It's exactly enough yeah. to kill him. <laughs> Perfect. This motherfucker stole the kill, and I'm proud of him. But it's better, than, it. it's better than Zeradon tanking uh, 11 damage from its turn. <laughs> yeah. Very yeah. Very, very true. You take them out before they can attack. That would All be right. the best strategy for these things. <laughs> yep. Uh, then the rest of the NPCs... Not really a whole lot of room in that room. So do you want them to just, like, pile in? Yeah. Here, or... Yeah. Uh... Leave, leave space at the door. Or you could have one of them <laughs> pick up that key. Since oh, true. The is, yeah, since the yeah. threat is gone, do you want us to move a little bit in the room? No. Okay. Okay. Uh, Jamie's gonna go ahead and pick up the key, because why not? Alright. Yeah. Just have the door key now. Please. Yeah, oh, he yes, was solemnly he looking at all the ashes everywhere and was like, wait, that's a door key. Hmm. <laughs> uh, come on, people, talk. Open up. That's about as fast as she can go, actually. She's our second armored unit. Can you believe that? Oh, I yeah. forgot that samurai oh, yeah, is technically samurais are armored. armored. Yeah, they're armored. That's about as good as we can do piling in, wise. Yeah. This guy on the front line, let's go! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not again! What are you not again? We're not even doing anything. Yeah, yeah there's nothing right there. She's fine. <laughs> well, staying in line. Okay, it is enemy phase. It is player phase. <laughs> <laughs> what I, <thought>. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the animations in my head as you said that. Same, same here. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Picturing that on the screen right now. That would be a fun oh, edit to do too. Oh, hold on, yeah. I'm making this eclipse. <laughs> Hell yeah! <laughs> yes. Yay! Hi YouTube. That would just Hi, be a YouTube. fun clip to make. <laughs> yeah. Just testing out your editing skills. Yeah. Oh, I know I could do it too. That, that's why I'm like, oh, that'll be fun. He's gonna find the oh, gift. I look forward to it. I wonder if you could. Probably a green screen of it. Hmm. I wonder if you can put custom UI into tabletop simulator. Ooh. I want to look in tabletop. A lot of stuff in... There is a lot of stuff you can do in tabletop, so I wouldn't be very surprised if you could put do a pin that. in that. I'm, I'm going to look into I'm going to look into modding tabletop simulator. Hell to the yeah. I mean, if there's a very like... big. If you need, like, someone to make a vector of it, I can do that. I have nothing to do, really, except work on commissions while I'm injured. I mean, hey. Cool. We will talk. Uh, Phoenix, you're up. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I don't have... Uh... I want to look at this uh, bookcase, actually. Uh, b -b 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 let me think. Give me a perception check. Right. Eighty. Damn it. Dang okay. it. <laughs> uh, nothing really catches your eye on the the shelf itself. Um, picking up a random tome you just scour through and it all just seems like nonsense to you so you just put it back okay and that'll be my turn it's like i don't i don't have like a key or anything to even try the chest so just oh to... my apologies who killed the who killed this one uh, uh me 
I forgot to mention that inside the sludge there was a chest key. Ah, okay. that makes sense. It has three uses. Mm. There it is. Did I automatically pick that up, or is that something I need yep. to do? You killed yes, the thing. So. Okay. <laughs> and then uh, <laughs> Locke killed the other one if the other one had anything. It did not. Okay. What the? Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm putting on my inventory. <laughs> You're running out of inventory space, I'm noticing. Who? Uh, not you. Never mind. I was looking at the wrong I was like, I have a bullinary. I was about to say, I think me and, me and Xander uh, had the least in our pockets. Yeah. I will unlock the chest. I, I, was, looking at, I was looking at Phoenix, who was like yep. carrying all the different kinds of tomes. <laughs> Like four oh, different potions and an arm scroll. <laughs> Phoenix, I travel light. Also, Phoenix. <laughs> no, I don't have any clothes though. Yeah. yeah you uh, just carry it, clothes. spare clothes. Spare clothes. Don't let people get yes. any ideas. <laughs> <laughs> we are a, we are a family friendly program. We say fuck a lot, but we don't want to see that. So you open it up. Yep. What you find is a key item, so you can keep it on your character sheet somewhere, but it does not take up an inventory space. You find okay. a a single tile with a dragon carved into it. Ooh. Puzzle time. Oh. oh no. Cool. A tile. So, like, is it a square tile? Mm -hmm. Like a stone tablet. That's right, a square tile. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> oh, <laughs> damn it! This is why we can't have anything. My God, <laughs> I didn't mean to have a visual reaction to that. Uh, <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> Can someone else go, please? Yep. Oh, that's, that's... Oh, okay. It's oh, it's Zerodor's turn. Oh, it's my turn. Do you want to perceive the bookshelf, or should I, Zerodor? Uh, you can go ahead. I'm going to take advantage of my slow movement speed and just prepare for the... Valid. Clever. Uh, unless you have the door key, I don't think standing directly on the door is a good idea. Well, someone can pass me the oh, door yeah. key once I get here. <laughs> yeah, she needs back. to get through. Through. Okay. You can make, you can make it. not on... Yeah, let's not unlock the door quite yet, though, until we've checked everything out. Yeah. And Jimmy yeah. passes you a door key with a single use. All right, yeah. I'll just stand by. All right. Perceive book. Perceive book. Uh, may, uh, you want to use perception? Aye, aye. Uh, so the 28 is what we want. Uh, huh? But let's see what we roll. Let's see. A 40. And similar deal as Phoenix, you're thumbing through the books, but you don't find anything of interest. It just all seems like gibberish and gobbledygook to you. Damn. Uh, yep, I got nothing. Alright, well... Curse shrug. I'm just... You know, with how much I love reading, this is kind of sad. Isn't it just? Mm-hmm. Anyway, uh, Locke goes ahead and picks the other chest. Why is it? What the fuck? I'll never understand the lesson either. Uh, the other key item is a tile that has a depiction of a man. Like a human person. Okay. Not puzzles that are meant for kindergartners that will never figure out. Depends. I mean, you gotta have your fucking easy dungeon first, man. True. This is your easy dungeon. Mm -hmm. oh, shoot. Keep on forgetting that, that, that button. Uh, it's right. not my turn anymore, so... <laughs> <laughs> so throw spike balls at Nessa. 
<laughs> oh god. Uh, well, Wait, it's just a matter of go again. <laughs> I mean, I'm just choosing even harder. <laughs> more books. Let I just want the TEDx thing. Yeah, go for it. Let, let me read me. again. I have an idea. Oh, you do? Wait, do you? Yeah. Um. Go for it. Ah, you know what? Hey, Phoenix. Oh, hey. Um, sorry I, sorry I arrived late. Um, eyes caught me. Oh. Um, yeah, I had a stern telling off. Um, understandably. Um, but, yeah. Hey, at least we did it. Hmm. Well, yeah. Good, I guess, good job. Uh, thank Question. you. Yay. I don't know. <laughs> we were successful, <laughs> I guess. Mission field successfully, I guess. Yeah. All right. Um, enjoy those books. All right. So, uh, I'm not even gonna try to perceive which one. I'm just gonna take one. You're just gonna take a book at oh. random. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Explain to me what you try to. Yeah, I want to like, uh, whether or not I understand it, I want to take a book with I us. Uh, and maybe try to understand it later. That's kind of neato. Can I have you give Ooh. me a, a wisdom check for just kind of like a gut feeling? Okay. okay. 27, wisdom... 26? No! Oh my uh. god. <laughs> no. I'm kind of mad about that. Me too. <laughs> Very mad about that. Oh. Uh, mulligan. <laughs> I kind of really do want to give you a one point mulligan, but dice or dice. Uh, if okay. it helps, I'll try to get on my side before I leave. My you, you, you take a book at random. Okay. Um, you can go ahead and just marking your notes that you have it. I'm not going to make it take up an inventory space. Okay. Uh, I'll put it down here. Yeah. Oh, no. I I have the notes channel. <laughs> I can put it oh, in yeah, there. Oh, yeah, that's true. Do notes. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. I, I, I use those I notes sometimes. Have in... That's what they're there for. Until yep. Discord is closed. Sometimes it can be once. Please don't. Don't I'm don't gonna. choose it. I'm not gonna. <laughs> Thank you, Zach. In the no mic. Oh, yeah. Is it? Just, <laughs> just, just, just me being stupid. <laughs> no, I love it. I like you being stupid. It's fun. But you're not stupid. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, top of the queue. Player phase, enemy phase, player phase again. Yep. <laughs> uh, so you gonna pick another even... book? <laughs> <laughs> no, the the book that I picked up. Uh, I guess, I guess I want to open it up and look through it then. Okay. We have time. We we got time. Might as fucking well. Give me an intelligence check. All right. Fourteen. Hey. Hey. There we hey. go. Yay. Okay. What you've picked up seems to be a journal of some sort. The notes that you're reading, at first they don't really seem to click into place, but you're reading about a process of what sounds to be transmogrification. The objective being able to turn living matter into a different state, like liquid or gas. The author describes the process as ichor, and you're not entirely oh. sure what that means. Interesting. Mm. Makes sense of what we saw in the bodies. Turning to the front of the book, you can see the name revealed to you in a language you formerly did not understand. 
The name of the journal is written Property of Zetziel the High Mage. Zetziel. Mm hmm. Hmm. And if you need spelling, that is Z E T Z I E L. Yes. <laughs> Okay. Very interesting. So yes, I will keep this with me. <laughs> oh, great. Yeah. Hmm. You have a tight squeeze. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I don't know what I can do. I mean, you can move seven and go through people, so you can go to the other side of the room. <laughs> technically closer to the door. <laughs> Yay! Uh, I mean, yeah, that's pretty much all I can do. <laughs> yeah. I'm over here now. Actually, I will switch Yay. back to my lance. That is what I'll do. Because I realize I, I attacked with my sword, and that changes things. It do. Are we ready to go forward? I believe uh, so. Okay. Can I open the door and then move, or...? Uh, opening a door is an action. Okay, so I would open the door and then I would have to stay put. Stand there, Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> ah, shit. All right, well... However, I mean... Nessa could perform for you. Yeah, Nessa can perform for you if you want to, go, like, like, get Jamie out of the way or something. Uh, I, 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 I'm just trying to... I was just going to move forward too, and then lock the two barrels so they can't merge. <laughs> oh. But, yeah. But if that, that's oh. if opening the door is my turn, yeah. that's my turn. That's... I mean, we do have an answer. Yeah. For this very, yeah. this very specific reason. Why yeah. did you go to me? Because it's your turn. Oh, it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Mom. <laughs> I, I've said it before, but I'll say it again. I love you, dude. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna peek at the bookshelf one more time, double check my resources, and then I'm gonna. I, because I'm not gonna move. I'm not gonna move until everyone else does. Okay. I'm not about to make that mistake. So you're just gonna do perception again, or how are you approaching this? I'd really like to see if anything sticks out to me whatsoever, be it an actual magic tome or like a, like what Phoenix maybe have found, any information. Okay. So you have a couple choices. Either you're going to be scanning through the shelf manually with your perception, you're going to be just using gut instinct to grab one at random with wisdom, uh, or you'll be using your intelligence to see if you can find anything magical. Fuck it, we'll use intelligence. All right, make an int roll. Alright. Please, 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 please. Damn it! Uh oh. Nothing uh, stands out to you as magical. Yeah, well, I tried. Uh, nothing I can find over here. Ah. Uh. Yeah. And I will be right back. I'll still be listening in via my headset, but I have to roll my scooter across the room to do a bio break. Fourth and scoot. Okie dokie. Uh, in that case, I'm going to get Zeradon into position. Okay. Hey, um, I can hear that blast from the tavern. Is everyone okay? Well, everyone can uh, nope. <laughs> And with that, I'm going uh, <laughs> oh, okay. Um, okay, no time to chat. Um, <laughs> no, nobody got hurt. Well, nobody will do. Nobody will do. Okay. Nessa shivering like a wet dog. Is there on shrug? Kachunk, 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 kachunk. <laughs> <laughs> did I? Yeah, I did. God, I love you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm All right. Enemy phase. These two barrels are going to use their action to emerge. 
But that is all they're going to be able to do this turn. Chat. Now, we've kind of put ourselves into an interesting spot here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm just going to try and hold as long as possible while you guys run past me and get into attack angle. Uh, I'm just trying to make sure that... that here's, here's the problem. This space is the only traversable ter terrain currently. Oh, those are walls! I thought that was like a pedestal or something. Mm-hmm. Mm. These spaces are not traversable. I thought that was just a raised platform. It is, but it's a very but large creepy. raised platform. Okay, can Force I throw the wall over them? Say what now? Sorry. I was being dog. The poopy horse <laughs> on the wall. <laughs> Shush. <laughs> Go ahead, Zach. Okay. Well, in that case, can I either throw allies or throw enemies into other spaces? No, unfortunately not. Can you eat my horse? Can people get on top of me? Can they <laughs> occupy the same space as you? Technically, if you rescue them. Like, can, can, we, can we bring in Z levels into this? <laughs> no, unfortunately not. If, oh, you are well. if you are rescuing someone, they are essentially helpless and you are carrying them a la Shrek and Fiona. Ah. Honestly, our best course of action is to have like one of our mages stand in like this corner and I just dance scum them until one of them's dead. And then we have Zeradon move him out of the way. Yeah. Yeah. Unless anyone objects. Don't object. Yeah. Has to be somewhat the range here. Yeah. I have an range. idea if we want to just kill something. Yeah, I absolutely true. can decimate one of them. That is fine with that me. That is too. true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Three, four, five, six. He does have what? Six move minimum? Oh, yeah. He, he can well. He could, fuck. He could stand here if he wanted to. Yeah, that, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. Have and then we can stand up there, and then we can still uh, position from the bottom. I think it's okay. yeah. Eyes has seven movement. Yeah, I was like six nice. at minimum. He's on a horse. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he got horse. We'll travel. He got horse. We'll travel. Yeah. <laughs> Any preferences to which one he's going to annihilate today, sir? Uh, did they have the same stats? Pretty much. Then it don't matter. Okay. Well, really, hero skull left. Did I say that? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a look. See, we don't really have an archer besides him, do we? Nope. I just no. hmm. The only other long range stuff is daggers and magic. Yeah, that's fine. I kind, I kind of want my backup character to be an archer once Zeradon does finally face tank into something he can't face tank. Archers are cool. Mm. They're like one of my favorite classes Archers. in Fire Emblem, despite the fact that they're not super useful. I like creatures. Archers are neat. Okay, eyes, what's it. your dexterity? Ah, yes. 18. <laughs> <laughs> Things are going to look really bad for eyes once we start running into stuff that he actually can't take. Yeah, we yeah. can't take advantage of him anymore. <laughs> that point. But today is not that actually... day. Yay. Okay. I am back. Welcome back. Welcome back. back. Do not let Ringo see the orb. By the way, that is shiny. It's in the that is middle so of the room. On with the orb. Good luck with she that. Is, her cat tendencies are gonna be like, ooh, touch. It's a pretty sizable <laughs> orb too. Mm -hmm. touch. Okay, so that's Push. two successful attacks for eyes. Two. Touch. At fourteen each. So uh, he did. <laughs> <laughs> now, now the Don is in much less danger. <laughs> yeah. Yes. There's still some, but you know, less. If I recall, we decided I is getting a kill as nine XP. Yeah. Yes. It was, it was, it was three per hit, nine per kill. <laughs> right. Oh, one more thing. He's cool. Hmm, one more thing. He's got 54 experience gained so far. Nice. Hey. That sounds like six no, kills. Not. More or less. Yeah. Uh, there's probably some hits been in there somewhere. Um. 
So yeah, the floor's yours. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. You can get about here. Perfect. I can't. I only have five moves. Oh me. Oh four, shit. Four, five. Oh yeah. We don't have a Lex. I mean. Yeah. I mean. Hmm. So I will move here. You have but... a Nessa. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you already used your turn, didn't you? Though. It's the next player phase, I think. Yeah, the the enemy yeah, phase is. is the monks bursting out of the barrels. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, I could get here, but I don't want to be in the way because I still won't be able to attack. We gotta get you a javelin. Yeah. Oh yeah, those exist. Yep. I am not allowed to throw this weapon. I could, but I'm not allowed. <laughs> um, the mysterious force stopping you. I, I'll move here just so we can keep that spot open in case more people need to get into attack from range. Smart. There you go. It's my turn. <laughs> well, we know what Zarnon's doing. I don't know. What's it there, Doug? Um, here. So we got nine strength. Goes with the I4. That would bump it up to 12. Going up against my resist. Hit. Its speed is six. How. Does the speed need to be double in order to double attack, or does it need to be uh, a certain five, five plus five? Yeah, a discrepancy five, of five. five. Okay, so as long as he doesn't crit, I should be fine. Yeah, screw it. Can't hide behind the shield forever. I'll go ahead and smack him. Hey, hey! Oh, Zerodon is pissed. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, so you're... Let me just double check here on something. Just the way that I wrote it. The shield stays off during at start, combat. At start of combat. Okay, so he could elect to do it here if he wanted to. What's your defense again? Uh, my base defense, 16. Christ, so he basically has to to do any damage. So he'll go ahead and activate Edgar's Curse, which deals 5 damage to him. So before you even attack it, it already has five damage. <laughs> Excellent. Hmm. Why does it seem so large compared to you guys? What the fuck? And you're using what to attack? Uh, the axe. Okay, which makes your strength, if I'm remembering right, 12? 13. 13? It's 13. Yeah. Base 12 plus one for axe. Right. Accuracy and then, if I'm remembering right, it's 85 accuracy. Yep. All right, make your swing. Got a 48. Nice. So that still does quite a bit of damage to him. That does seven damage total. That takes him down from 21 to, if I'm right, 16. Did you say Wait. five damage? Seven. Seven. Damn. So... 14. 14. Yep. My bad. I'm a little slow sometimes when it comes to math. You guys can do math. <laughs> yes. I'm afraid we'll have to use math. <laughs> I'm afraid we'll have to we use math. We got a reference in every session going forward. Yep. Yep, we got it. Luckily, your speed is three, right? Yes. Well, okay. He's going to go ahead and attack you. What's your dodge chance? My dodge is 14. Damn. Jesus. That's kind of impressive, honestly. All right. So he rolled a 94. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> he hit himself oh. with confusion. Swing and a miss. Eh. Uh, Woohoo. So apart from being a regular tank, you're also a dodge tank. How do you feel? 
<laughs> so go ahead and gain 10 experience from that encounter. Yep, I already did that. Poifik. Hey, hey Koob Doobie. What's up, ma'am? Can I land on the same tile, tile as someone and do a reposition? On the same tile as someone? No. Damn. Well, there goes my idea to get you closer, Phoenix. <laughs> Um, because yeah. I have the ability to reposition people. That was my shtick. <laughs> um, it, it gets really funny when you consider that you could also reposition a guy on a horse and his horse. Yes. Suplex the horse. <laughs> Don't the guy on it. <laughs> so, so does that mean your move is like, what, five? Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh You could probably... Hold your turn until after yeah, Nessa does her okay. thing. We'll go ahead and hold you. Hold. Oh, yeah, there'll shit. be a space where Phoenix currently is. What up, bro? Once I've moved her. I realized that my dodge should have actually been nine. I forgot okay. that I was still. Um, I was still. I saw the number set in for when I was using the lines. Okay, let me just double check that then for accuracy. Just to be on the safe side, I think it still is a miss. Yeah, you said it was a ninety-four. Mm hmm Yeah, that's that's still a miss. Okay. Yeah, I'm 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 sorry. I was sitting there doing math, like, why is my dodge so high? And I was starting to look at numbers, like, oh wait, there it is. Okay. Whoops. Wrong. Do hickey. You're fine. Yeah, unarmed attacks have ninety-five accuracy, so with your dodge chance involved, ninety-four would have been a miss, even if you had a dodge chance of one. So you're good. Great. You're fine. Uh, so you're saying you're holding off on your turn, so it's Squish's time. It is, and I know exactly what I'm doing. Um, yeah. Uh, Phoenix, uh, go forth and zap something, <laughs> please. Will do. <laughs> uh, alrighty. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and give Phoenix a turn first. We wanted to give... Ringo turn first, just uh, and me so that Ringo could uh, move. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Boop, boop. Beep, boop. Beep, boop. And I shall oh. attack a guy. Thing. Alrighty. Blob. Good thing there's no friendly fire on a critical miss or anything. Okay. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Mm -hmm. That'd be a good way to go. It'd be. F hey, <laughs> stop that. In the back. <laughs> At least what? Hey, at least let me put you out of your misery, because you'd be seeing some stars, at least. It, it would suck even more, because I'm using thunder magic, which is yeah. effective, which which gives uh, more damage against armored foes. Yeah. I remember I made thunder damage kind of silly, because I didn't want it to, like, just be a straight-up bonus like it was last time around. How did I do it this round? Let me double-check. Oh, it, yeah, the, the only one that is still effective is wind versus right. flying uh fire just gives plus a little bit more versus cavalry thunder does plus a little bit more versus armor that makes sense okay mm -hmm. which i still love heals a 10 home slice and heals a 30 dog <laughs> so good <laughs> I, I, I think it's a good I way like, to balance it yeah i love that and then we get a little sippy restores uh, 10 hp to the user <laughs> And Did I write, take a little sippy on yours? Hang on. No, I don't remember if it was me or you. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... You said broken. That's great. Okay. M monks don't count as armored or anything, right? I believe uh, not. Let me double check my list because here. Because they aren't actually holding gauntlets. I don't think so. That doesn't well, matter. It's a, it's a monk with a question mark. So it's it, kind of... It's, a, that's also a good point. In the shape of a monk. <laughs> like it, it might not even have a proper alignment. It's an infantry oh. class. Okay. Any rate, I am attacking, and I rolled a fifty-two. Okay, that is enough to hit. Uh, your magic again? Eleven magic. Eleven versus his six res. That's five damage. So 14 minus 5 is 9. Bada boom. 
Then my speed is nine, which is not enough. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead, gain your ten and your experience, of course. Yeah. All right. Uh, it's uh, PT's turn. <laughs> yeah. Yes. You know, for fun's sake, one, two, three, four, five. Fringa's gonna look at Nessa and go, Do you wanna make Xeradon go again after so you, he can go again next round? Uh if anyone if no one objects, sure. And you just see Ringo pick up Nessa like she weighs nothing and repositions her Oh my the god the other side. Oops. Oh. Rose at Zerdon. Oh, hello there. Hello. <laughs> What's your dexterity? That must have hurt. <laughs> yeah, just Ringo looks down, looks back up. I forget I can do that. Lift with your legs. What do you mean you can forget you can do that? <laughs> Lift with your legs, not your back. <laughs> yeah. You you are really cool like stuff. holding a sa a small sack of flour, by the way. Huh. Ugh. She's she weighs nothing to me. Oh. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Uh, well, there's not really a whole lot we can do as far as the NPCs go. Yeah. Locke can go like there. Hi, Locke. Hey. This is my bad for putting you guys in a very tight corridor, and also there's like 12 of you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just another day in the Fire Emblem. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're, uh... Fire Emblem. This is a joke for Zach, but we're Space Hulk in this shit. Yeah, I was actually <laughs> looking for a Space Hulk gif earlier when we came into this room after I realized that this wasn't passable. I was like, oh, yeah, but Space Hulk, and I was going to go find, like... The scene from the cartoon of Scrub, 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 important person, very important person. <laughs> but, Get the I, flavor, the heavy flavor. Yeah. I just like how Locke is getting to witness, Nessa and Locke are getting to witness Ringo finally see the <laughs> orb over her eyes his head, and she's just, oh, it's shiny. I'm trying to find that page for you there so we can actually uh, show them what we mean. Where was it? I promise I don't know if it's in 10 or... But... Oh, I found it. Oh. It's not like a, it's not like a GIF, but I just grabbed it from the actual YouTube channel, so... Here you go. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Except we're backwards. Here's the very yeah. important person right yeah. there. <laughs> so, very, very important person, important person, scrub, 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 scrub. It's full of floors in Hyrule. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> That's a happy stop, not a bad stop. You don't have to apologize for that one. <laughs> I apologize for everything. I know you do, buddy. I love you. Are you, are you sure you're not Canadian? <laughs> She's, um... I'm, oh, wait, I'm no. British. Uh, okay, I'm British because I'm owned by England. No, I'm not owned by England. That's North so... Ireland is owned by England. I'm, I'm in phrasing? the weird part of Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in the apologetic part of Ireland. We're just gonna have this monk attack there, Don. Fuck's sakes. Yep. Oh, wait. <laughs> I yes. something. He, has to, he has to do his Icarus curse, so that's another five damage by default. Whoo... <laughs> 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 Zach, you're a lucky boy. Oh. He rolled a six. His crit chance oh. is four. All right. Wait a minute. Oh, oh right. Oh. He has focus. Mm -hmm. okay. That's so plus five cool. crit dodge when initiating. So, yeah, he still misses the crit just barely. Oh. And then oh. Uh, I'm taking. Uh, let's see. You have so one resistance 12. by default, right? Yeah, so I'm taking 11 damage. Remember, this guy hits twice. Like, that's how fists work. He, do, he does two attacks per one combat, so nine, okay. three. So that's 11 twice, so 22. 22. Oh, that's everywhere. 
so I already had two damage. I'm at 24. Okay. I'm alive, technically. <laughs> can I hit back? You can. Zerdon didn't hear no bell. <laughs> yeah. Stop. Put in the chest. Now I got Sorry. 36. That still is enough to hit. What's your strength again? 13? Yes. Whew. It's enough to finish oh, it off. Jamie! Get the boy! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're level 3, it's level 3. If I'm remembering right, that's 30 XP. Yep. Thanks. Nice kill! You're worrying me, son. You're worrying me. <laughs> nice on! So, I don't know if you would want this, uh, Zeradon, but I do have this concoction here. <laughs> it's much better than a vulnerary. It heals 30 points of damage. Uh, oh, heals it, you 30 are, are you sure? I Yes, it, it's more than I need. <laughs> Alright, can I go ahead and do that now, or do I have to wait for like next go-around? We'll still go ahead and say you have to wait for next go around because we're still technically in danger. That's okay. fair. Quote unquote. Hey, danger. I'm in danger. Yeah, no, no. I'm in danger. But that's that's very sweet of you there, Phoenix. That's adorable. Just helping out the boy. Yeah. But like I'm I'm staring I've been staring at the concoction for a while and I'm like, I'm it's gonna be so long before I even think about using that. <laughs> Now, it is still a beverage, so you'll still have to consume it. Yeah. I assume you're wearing your helmet. <laughs> It'd be really funny to just, like, pour it over the eyes and just <laughs> oh, try yeah. to do it that way. Oh, their eye drops. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, but, yeah, no, I'll, I'll probably have to actually lift up my mind. Or, just or just slam it into your face like a weapon. <laughs> Here's what you do. Right. You take the bottle and you eat the bottle like a normal that's, person. <laughs> that's what I used to say in the first campaign. I'm going to chomp a yeah, bone crunch. Crunch. Yep. Yeah, we did, crunch. We did treat, we did treat <laughs> them like fucking uh, pop rock. I didn't know what it was when I first started, so I'm like, I'm just going to eat it. And you're like, that's it's, not... You it's, don't a, it's, eat. A, it's, a, it's a glass or leather container containing a liquid. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, leather, extra liver. Yeah. I could always just say I have, oh, no. I, I have a little bit there. Mm -hmm. uh, Google defines it as a medicine used in the healing of wounds, but Fire Emblem defines it as a drink, so. Mm -hmm. You just smeared some, like, visceral right. liquid oh, that, on your face. That would be for a vulnerary. A concoction uh, implies that it's uh, like a, a liquid that you've been. that has been made. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. So the idea of you just right. smearing medicine just on for a vulnerary, just like a jello-like substance. Just... It'd be like a, like a paste made by a mortar and pestle if I had to wager any kind of thing with what they were trying to go for, but I'm yeah. going to like hand wave a few things and just call it the same thing as like Final Fantasy Potion, High Potion. It's a drink. Yeah, yeah that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Um, so the... The monk attacking him was enemy phase. Is there anything else happening before I start next turn mm -hmm. then? Okay, so in that case, I'll just move to the other side and hand the, co uh, hand the concoction over. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, and Zachary, for your frame of reference, uh, it has three uses and heals you 30 HP when used. Oh, I thought that was a one-shot thing. Okay, let me go ahead and... No, that's Emblem. the best part about potions in, final, in Fire Emblem is you get three uses out of them usually, unless they're like a specialty thing. Yeah, like tonics and stuff like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Depending or on the some... game, uh, they even have like up to five uses, like the original yep. one was five. That's true. Yep. Or you could be uh, like Hoob and give us a weird hermit who gave us weird potions. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I remember those. <laughs> In Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn, they had eight uses. Yep. Because, because they knew that game so was fucking hard. <laughs> well, I would give you something in return, but I don't really have anything. Oh, no, it's fine. I don't no, need anything. Just... Give her just I'm a just peek of your eyes, and that's all we get. That being said, sure. when you when you do lift up your mask to um to, to have a swig, what do we see? 
I guess it would be, you know, definitely have a bit of a thicker beard, a bit furry, a bit ursine looking, but scar across one eye, and then, yeah, I guess I'll take a sweet use. That actually heals me to full. So. Nice. Rinko really rapidly sketching in her journal thing. <laughs> Jeez, no. Write that down, write that down! <laughs> it's like, a, yeah, like a, if you want to give a more detailed description, go ahead, since I'm not 100% certain. Uh, like, uh, I think that's pretty apt, yeah. Like, kind of like, not like pale skin, but like, you know, you've seen some sun, you got a, like a thick beard. Uh, what do you think? Like, brown hair, black hair? What? Yeah, reddish brown. Reddish brown. Finish brown, maybe some streaks of gray in there. Yeah. Oh, salt and pepper. Ooh. <laughs> huh. Which would be more well, like paprika and salt, but yeah. <laughs> no, we don't judge. It's spicy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and yeah. That's there done. Cool. Um, <laughs> after this turn, I'm probably going to have to lay down my leg oh. throbbing. Oh, but we're so close to the end here. I, I know. know. I can hold let's I can let's hold just go. Off. I can hold off as much as I need to, but I just gotta elevate it funny, so if I okay. sound farther and farther away from the mic, that's what's going on. I understand. Take your time. Uh, Alright. I'm gonna take a step in, immediately look at the thing behind eyes, and go... So, what's that? Your guess is as good as mine. It looks to be fastened to the pedestal somehow, though. Might if I take a look? By all means. Go kind of just gets real, real close. Ooh. Abu, no! <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking that. Yeah, everyone, Abu, no. Uh, I'm gonna scan a pretty magical origin, if possible. Okay. Uh, give me an intelligence roll. Intelligence. Okie dokie. So, uh, uh, let me get into the right server. I was in the wrong room. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. You're fine. Uh, uh huh. I think Moach died. Oh, wow. Yeah. You kind of get like lost in your reflection for a bit, but you can't sense any magical properties of it. Touch. Please, please, <laughs> please note, this thing is about as big as you guys are. It's like five feet in Yeah, that's what I was diameter. thinking. <laughs> like, like, it's got to be a big one. one. Okay. Unfortunately, this that's is the cat I would like you to know that this is the cat instinct taking over and she's touching it. Bap. It's heavy. It doesn't move from its spot because I don't have the assets to do that. Yeah, it's a uh, fast <laughs> down, it seems. No but... magical properties that I can gauge. But I am really bad, apparently, at viewing things. Uh, can I walk around the little pedestal part? Sure. Like... With a little look -see? <laughs> you just call it flavor tech. <laughs> you can't actually technically land on any of those spaces. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I got Remind nothing. A... <laughs> no one will get the reference it's reminding me of a scene in Sea of, Star sea of Stars. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't got anything on that. Sorry. That's about all I got. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know what I can do. Uh, Ringo, open sesame! <laughs> That's all I got. <laughs> Just all the NPCs piling in. Um, alrighty, I should probably. Oh, Daryl, I haven't played for you yet. Hi. Hello. Um, how? I hope everyone. How was everyone that was here? Um, while I was gone, I hope no one was worried. Uh, was I was really worried about. Pretty uneventful. 
it was pretty uneventful. We kind of just kept watch, making sure no one else was coming in. Which, I don't know how loud that explosion was, but we might, I hope we didn't loud. attract too much attention. Uh, oh, yeah, I, mean, I, heard it. I heard it from the tavern. Ooh. Okay. We well, probably could have just done like a minor case of the, like a half keg of the fucking lantern oil, but... Uh, no, it, it, it's, fine. It, it's fine. It's fine. It, 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 it took out the main room, so it was helpful. Yeah. We just might have yeah. unexpected reinforcements or people, concerned citizens. I mean, it, it did six to barrels. Isis dismay. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, whatever's going on here, we need to figure out and hopefully... Whatever's down here justifies our actions. Oh, for sure. Know. Hey, Coop, do we know what these are? Broken pillars kind of looks like it to me. <laughs> you yeah, haven't examined them. Like... Yeah, no, it might be a good idea to examine them. All right. The say, are did you play for Geralt? Is that what you did? Yes, I did. Yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, move, horseman. Okay. <laughs> move, horseman. Show that I'm horse. I'm running out of waves. <laughs> Show that dancing horse to us. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> he can't dance. Yes, he can. I'm teaching him. He knows the t step to the left, step to the right. We're getting I'm just picturing somewhere. the horse doing a box step. <laughs> Ringo, we will talk later box. about dancing lessons. Oh. <laughs> I'm getting really <laughs> close to the door, but yeah, fine. That's, that's where I'm at. <laughs> okay. Can I just perceive around the room? Is there anything with this door that's uh, can or sure. carvings or anything in here that catch my attention? Uh, just a general perception check. I'm all out of that, sure. Mm. Da, 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 da. Oh, Six. nice. Oh. Man, nice. Yeah. 24 is my perception. So you do perceive around this here room. Uh, something that stands out to you while you're looking around, there are some runes along the pedestal holding that giant um, glass object. Uh -huh. As you're perceiving them, a, a sort of message gets kind of like beamed into your mind through forces you don't quite understand. Oh, fun. It sounds like it's a riddle. <laughs> In the mouth of one lies the other. To the left are the weak, and the right are the strong. Do you think that's yeah. what the tile uses are? Oh, I figured. Ah. Uh. So. Man in the mouth of the dragon. And whoever mm -hmm. wrote that riddle probably perceives dragons as the more powerful. I don't know. Dragons <laughs> are considered strong. I guess you will just repeat that out loud. Anyone else getting weird voices? No. I <laughs> None more than you, Joel. The voice in the back of my head is telling me to try to steal this orb, but I'm not supposed to listen to that anymore. Anyone getting riddles in their heads? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. A I do like a good riddle, though. And I will repeat the riddle because Xander cannot remember off the top of my head. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll go ahead and do it for you. In the mouth of the <laughs> one the of the lies the other. The weak are what is left, and the right are, or no, and the strong are what is right. I got the middle wrong. Uh, strong. What, what, the strong what is what tile? is right. Okay, strong is what is right. Uh, the weak is. And if I recall correctly, Geralt, you ha you found a tile in that uh, chest back there, right? Yeah, I'll pull out. Yeah, it's got a, a dragon carved onto it. 
Uh, Locke also has the Mantile. Mm hmm. Okay, so we got uh, two tiles. A left and right. Is there is do do you see anything where we put these tiles, maybe? I would assume here. Be a good guess as any. Wanna give it a try? I'll give it a try. Sure. Since it's technically my turn anyway. <laughs> Alright. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so which one are you putting where? I'm looking at this one here. I rolled a five on my perception, if that's a... <laughs> hey. Hell yeah. That is pretty fucking good right there. So in this uh, broken pillar, you do see that there is a section that looks like it could fit one square-looking object. Okay. Okay. Square hold. <laughs> Shut the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Good. There, there is a little bit of an indent on this thing here that looks like it should be able to fit that thing that you got. Hmm. Okay. The weak is what is left, strong is what is right. And we have a man and a dragon. Gee, I wonder which one is the strong one. Probably the dragon. No <laughs> well, offense. Well, depends on the nature of the cult. It could be a humanity first sort of thing. That's true. Depends on the cult. Hmm. I'm gonna say the dragon, though. I mean, yeah. we're getting close to Lagos area. No offense. As the Lagos. Well, I mean, I mean, dragon dragons would be manicate. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I'd almost say we put the dragon on the right, on this right pedestal then. And the okay. man on the left. All right. So, are we, put, are we in turn order still, or are we just doing things? We're just kind of doing things, man. All right. All right. Uh, just for all intents and purposes, I'm going to just kind of hand wipe a few things. We're not going to be having any more combat this round. Okay. okay. Just want to All give right. you that spoiler. So, as you place the two pedestals, <laughs> or bleh, bleh, as you place the two uh, tiles in their proper pedestals, a beam of light goes from the orb in the center to the door. The door opens of its own volition. And these two walls sink into the floor. Interesting. Mm -hmm. What you see next is a a very large man in the center of this room with looks to be several glowing lanterns. And on the floor, a large tile that looks in the shape of an ancient dragon. Uh-oh. The man is muttering something under his breath, and in his other hand, the one that's not carrying that large scepter, um, is holding a a woman by her neck and just kind of holding her up. She looks unconscious. Mm. Once the door opens, the man looks at the the party just kind of standing before him. And he kind of smiles a little. He looks directly at eyes. And he says, I wonder when you would come to stop me again. How very, very interesting. Things are playing out a little different than last we met. But you wouldn't remember that. That's fine. Ah. <sighs> What a shame, what a shame, what a shame. Well, it seems that you have gotten too far and learned too much, so I'll leave you with this. I've already won. There's no point in stopping me. Farewell, until next we meet, Prince Siner. 
and the man disappears in a puff of smoke. I'm sorry. Ah! I'm back on flight. Oh. And one by one, the lights go out. Did he take the monk with him? No. She was left laying directly on the middle of the dragon's um, pedestal here. We need to make sure she's okay. Yep. Yep, someone with more medical knowledge. Jamie. <laughs> You can move freely about this room, don't have to worry about, like, positioning or anything. Right, I'm going to recommend that these two get inside, and I'm going to stay here and wait for the cops. Just in case. <laughs> <laughs> and I believe, unless you want to, you know, interrogate this poor woman, that's where we're going to no. leave off. You want to you yeah. move forward a little bit? Add something else. I can't really, like, uh. sit where I need to anymore. That is up to y'all. She's conscious at this point, right? Uh, She's laying down, uh, but she does, like, look like she's looking around, looking at you guys. Okay. Hey, hey, you're okay. You all right? Um, uh, All right. Uh, Can you give us a name or what happened? Um, I remember coming to the temple to pray. Mm-hmm. I remember feeling like I was in danger. I remember screaming, and now I'm here. Mm. Anything before that is a bit hazy, though. I, I um... Uh, who are you? Where am I? Uh, um... Well... Um... I can't even think right now myself. I'm in pain. Oh. Um, okay. I guess I would just ask then, like, um, so this ha- how did this there did this happen to you today, or has this been going on? Because I've been hearing about screams for the last month from someone. Um, as far as I can remember, I. I guess it all happened today. Time is a little fuzzy for me. Oh, so there could be multiple. Okay. And what he said... It's a little weird. Alright, um... Take it easy. Uh, we'll have to regroup and... figure this whole thing out. Okay. You're safe with us, though. Uh... I guess I'd go back out into the room. Um... Hey, eyes, uh, we have a situation. So... <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, okay, you know what I mean. <laughs> so, before we ventured into this temple, I was talking to Taro, and she mentioned these screams were happening for the last month or so. Um, according to the woman in that altar room, she might have only been in here today, meaning there were multiple. So whatever's been going on, there might be multiple Uh, victims. Oh god. It could have been some sort of uh, process, which is what was creating the uh, goopy monks in the barrels. Oh Oh, god. Oh god, okay. Um... Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, but she's okay? The the, the, the girl? Um, she's... Yeah. Jamie's catching her up. Well, um, I, 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 oh, I guess until we can get this whole situation figured out, she can stay with us. I don't know if she has any place to go or anything, but um, we'll get her a room at the tavern and just go from there. Yeah, that's for the best. I'm going to just place my like jacket on her shoulders just to kind of keep her warm and safe. <laughs> um, figure out as much as you can. Um, it is two in the morning, by my reckoning. It's been several hours yeah uh good job everyone um we're gonna call this one you know what you did a lot of work today uh meet me in the morning for payroll uh i need to figure some things out um just leave me be for a bit i'm gonna get some rest 
Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. sir. Okay. Uh, after you get some rest, there there's some things I want to probe your mind about. Yeah. There's so a lot tomorrow. of things we're, we're going to need to talk about. Tomorrow, yeah. not tonight. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Uh, okay. I want, want to make sure everyone gets a full eight hours, so we're going to head out of this city at noon. I have a vague feeling that they're not going to want us to stick around. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's Appreciate exactly you, Zerodon. Get some rest. <laughs> That's an order. Uh. Don't want anyone doing anything stupid or breaking curfew or anything. <laughs> kind of like, kind of like looks Done. in Ness's direction. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> God, I'm gonna have to explain so much shit to people. <laughs> I hate being a yeah, you are. Welcome to being a manager. Mm hmm. <laughs> I didn't want this role. He really did. He, he, he really has been forced into it. <laughs> you wanted your title back. We're getting you in your kingdom. My God, at what cost? <laughs> But God, at what cost? <laughs> and that I is guess. our session for today. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Ooh. Good job, everybody. Ooh. Yay. I'm sorry towards the end I became a, unintelligible. Fine. You're good. You're good. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and write how much money you're going to get for next time. Yay. <laughs> We're getting paid, guys. We're making the payroll final. I'm Yay. gonna have money. And you know what's really funny? Server what? just crashed. Oh. Yeah. Hey, I was wondering about that. I saw the peachy disconnect. It didn't. Like, oh, it I didn't have the but yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, you had the internet connection icon next to you. <sighs> well, uh, I I will let you guys know that you have gained a thousand group renown for this whole adventure. Hey. <laughs> Awesome. Uh, nice. We could talk awesome. about so how we want to spend that next time. <laughs> mm hmm. Which is yeah. going to be in two weeks. Yeah. Ooh. Whoa. And I, I I'm going to double check to make sure. I can't even take my pain medication. Yes. I'm just making sure I have that day off. Because I know I have next Tuesday off. Right. But uh, I want to make sure I have the 20th hoist. Holy shit, really? I'm 20 XP away from level 5 because of that. Damn. Holy fucking shit. Hey, same. Well, I have next Tuesday <laughs> off, so theoretically, if I don't have the 21st off, we can try doing it next week, but I probably won't have a map prepared. Yeah. But we'll, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll yeah. Right here. yeah. It, it's I mean, fine. We uh, yeah. we kind of wanted uh, wanted to try to get with you about just doing like a sit down and yeah. talk kind of session. <laughs> Okay, we could have a general. We could have a general camp by the roadside yeah. session. Mm -hmm. And after this experience, that that feels like a right. There's a lot move, to talk actually. about. Yeah, there's, yeah. <laughs> there's a lot of things to talk about. Holy shit! Whoa. Oh fuck! And I'm just over here cleaning my axe. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I tried wow. talking to you, and you're just like, nope. <laughs> I got a lot of conversation. Well, to be fair, that was in the middle of a combat situation. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I thought Sarah John was the coolest. I fucking... <laughs> that, that's my friend. <laughs> Somehow. Oh, do you I want to see the updated one? Oh, yeah. Yeah. We did, we did a few more things today. Yep. Yes, please. Um, other than that, I'm going to go ahead and finally hit stop recording. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize you were still going. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. <laughs>